What's up? A pizza burger sounds delicious, by the way. I don't should it be- should it sound delicious? I don't know. Anyway, welcome back to Terraria! Last time, um, yeah, we beat Eye of Cthulhu, we beat Goblin Invasion, uh, after building houses for what feels like 15 freaking hours. I literally got my dates wrong and waited for the stream time yesterday when it wasn't yesterday, yeah. I know how it can be to adjust to new schedules and stuff, but hopefully over time it'll, uh, set in your head that it's Saturday now. Anyway, I've decided to spare you all for more house building for another two, three hours total. I've decided to just go ahead and build some stuff off camera. As you see, I've got, um, I've got roots under here leading to two rooms, plus a bedroom that I think I might... It would not mean chopping down this tree or, like, moving this, but I might make a tunnel to it. Leaves, yeah, I, um, changed the background walls of these to leaves. I also added these at the end of last stream, the leaves here. And, uh, which I think makes it look more and more like a tree. And then I added some leaf wall down here. Some living leaf, it's known as. I also went to build a jungle house and even put up the pylons. So now we could teleport there. And negative floors, yep. Basements, roots, whatever you want to call them. Uh, so yeah, it's gonna be so much easier to teleport there. I could show off my build real quick. It's not terribly great. It's kind of just a mahogany version of the same thing with leaves that look kind of terrible. And then one room over here that I made out of bamboo because I've discovered bamboo is actually a pretty cool way to build stuff. Is there anyone else who could go here? Like, aside from these guys? I don't know. There's no one else who likes the jungle in particular who could go here. I guess I could throw the angler in there because I think our main town's kind of full of people, but yeah. Um... Roots seem cooler, yeah. I definitely... I do like this design. I'm probably gonna add a few more rooms as we unlock more and more NPCs, but I think now that I've done all of this, we should have enough empty spaces for the next, like, three or four NPCs, so now we can focus all our efforts on exploration. Oh yeah, I also... I added a third desert house, and the die trader's supposed to go there. He's still here right now. It's gonna take him a while to get over there, though. So, yeah, I was thinking mainly this time, we'll just go to the jungle caves. I do also want to clear up more of this place. We might go back to ice caves, uh, but there's like a lot of space right here that I haven't been to, and I feel like we could find mushroom biomes, we could find all sorts of cool stuff there. Uh, so I think, yeah, we'll be, we're probably going to take our spelunking adventures down this way. In fact, I see an open spot on the map. So, uh, but first, I said we're doing jungle, so we're doing jungle. Ooh, is this, is this going to go right down into the jungle? Because that'd be cool if it does. Let's see, is there anything I feel like buying from you right now? We could grow some pumpkins. Get some pumpkin blocks. Use those for something. I don't believe I have this yet. Hello? Oh, th that's just the painter shooting at a thing. I didn't know he had that weapon. Really cool. Oh, the dirt rod, right? <laughs> Alright. Oh, actually, I'm trying to save up gold right now for the mini shark. So I think I'm only gonna get five of these. And, oh, that's four gold. Ugh. But we're gonna be getting lots of gold from the caves. So I think, yeah, I'm gonna splurge. Sorry, uh, other person- I can't remember their username right now, who recommended that I get the thingy. I kind of want this. Friends from accidentally destroying the environment. I might not actually be the greatest thing going through the jungle, because there's gonna be so many vines, but still. This would be great to have, like, building stuff. Alright, does this go down faster? It goes down to a little vein of copper ore. Uh, nothing much. I'll mark that it's there, and then I'll leave. Not do anything with that. Can't remember how the jungle is pre-hard mode. I know that the jungle caves in hard mode on expert are horrid, and I'm not looking forward to that. But right now they should be fairly tame for what they are. Okay, we got a surface chest here. We got sluggish Wanda Sparking. Man, we found the Wanda Sparking too late. I really loved the Wanda Sparking in my first few playthroughs, but now it's just kind of not that great. I think I might go back home to drop these off real quick. Plus copper bars. We'll keep the wand of sparking, though. Time for Factorio in Terraria with environmental damage. I haven't uh, played Factorio. So I may not fully understand that. I've heard of it, though. I, I don't know if it's the type of thing I would like. I know that it's kind of like, you know... Like this thing, you have this whole automated factory and you gotta keep expanding it and expanding it. But I don't know if it's my thing, exactly. I love having all this music from different games, um, because it's like, one second, you can have something from Mario Galaxy, and then the next, Chrono Trigger. It's like you're going ten years in the past. 
one of the more attractive items to find down in jungle caves. I think I'm just gonna create a little thing right here in a pit we can dig down and go right down through. Uh, put some platforms up there, though. Uh, one thing I'm really looking uh, forward to finding is perhaps the boomstick, a shotgun. I play Mindustry and it's inspired in it. Oh, is it like, is Mindustry inspired by Factorio? Or something? Oh, you know, another fun stream game actually might be Don't Starve. Ow. I bought the- I bought Don't Starve because of Terraria, because, uh, Terraria and Don't Starve have a little crossover, so there is actually some, like, Don't Starve-related stuff in the, to find in this game, which we will be doing, because uh, it's fun content. Um, and I decided to buy Don't Starve because of that. Oh, yeah, that's why I don't want this. It's so much harder to break pots. Cool to make stuff and then be proud. Yeah. Yeah, it's so much harder to break pots when you, um, have that on. That's why... I usually never like having it on when I'm exploring, but when I'm building stuff, it's great. All right. I don't know if this is exactly the best way to enter this. Hello, worm. A worm? All right. Since these slimes are underground, they're actually going to be coming after me by default. Excuse me. Die, please. My industry is inspired by Factorio, I assume. Cool. I think I've heard, like, a couple people mention Mindustry. When I say I heard of a game, that usually means I heard its name somewhere. But not... <laughs> I, I haven't done any more than that, I haven't seen it at all, I haven't played it at all. <laughs> all right. Okay, do I should say that to clarify how much, uh... I'm likely to know about a game that someone talks about. Just by what I say. We're near the desert, apparently? <laughs> Somehow did that no damage, didn't intend to do that, but it worked out. Okay, it's just a sand deposit down here. Those can cause the water to turn yellow, even though there's no actual desert biome. That's you dead. Play Mind Destroy. It's also a tower defense game. That'll be interesting. I haven't played a tower defense game in a long time. I guess I never was like the biggest. I was never the biggest fan of them, but I, they can be fun. Like, because it's like you have to set up. The gameplay is you setting up the stuff, and then you just sit there and watch it happen. I think there's like a couple tower defense games I play where you can modify it on the go to like real quick change some stuff around. One of those is Creeper World, which. Um, I remember liking a lot. Hey, we got a pile of gold. All right, uh, I'm going to release the boulder. Get out of the way. Oh, yeah. All right. Um. Through. Nothing else to say right now because I'm trying to find a way down. I thought there would be more of a way down here. Those usually lead to better cave entrances, but oh, this is probably a better cave entrance actually. Oh, pink, pinky! There's a pinky around. Where's the pinky? I have the life form analyzer on, so it's telling me where rare mobs are. I think I see it. It's up above. It's where I was before. Yep, that's it. It looks more red. It's more ready. Ready to rumble. That's what. <laughs> All right. Here's the archery. The archery of archery. I don't know. Now you can die, this sir. Come on, come on. No, that's a boulder! I didn't see that! Oh, God. Minus three's unit, so it does have strategy and attack. Uh, sectors like fungal passage thingy. So does it mean that, like, do you set stuff up and then watch whatever happens as a result of it, or can you move stuff around on the go? Or, like, change some things? Okay. Okay. That I didn't exactly get uh, the answer out from that. If that's what you were trying to say, I'm sorry. I just don't. <laughs> I don't know. It'd be easier if I knew more about that game. Right. Move units to attack and do stuff. Is it during an onslaught of enemies or before? Oh, a skeleton statue.
Because I would know that you would move units, because that's how tower defense games are, but like, is it during or before an onslaught of enemies? A wave. I guess that's a, the Creeper World might honestly be the only tower defense game that lets you actually move stuff on live. I don't know, though. I'm gonna go grab the skeleton statue, then I think I'm gonna go to the other round. Yeah, it's too much stuff to talk about. Fair. <laughs> oh, God. You know, like, on a similar note, I feel like this game, Terraria, is really hard to describe. Whenever... Whenever someone would ask me, like, or what, if someone ever asked me, what's Terraria like? It's really hard to describe what it's like without making comparisons to the obvious, to Minecraft. And if you say, it's like Minecraft, but in 2D, there's like a 20% chance that they're no longer at all interested in the game. All right, you know what? I'm going to go back home, drop some stuff off, and then we're going to take that other entrance that looks more appealing. Because, man, this is getting me nowhere. Dye materials. Let's plant some pumpkins around. Boom. Boop. Uh, boop. Oh, wait. Not there. Shit. That's going to block the door. I just wasted a pumpkin seed. Well, it's okay. I got the money. I can buy more. Alright. Ooh, okay. We actually got a stinger already. I'll put that in, uh, this, because it's pretty similar, actually. But yeah, like, I don't know. Without making comparisons to Minecraft, I have no idea how I would describe this game. Uh, it's a sandbox game? Metroidvania? You, uh, go collect stuff to fight bosses, and then use the boss's drops to go fight- to collect to stronger stuff and fight stronger bosses? I mean, I just described the progression of the game pretty succinctly, but... Of course, like, they probably want more details than that, and I just- I don't know what to tell them, because it's like... <laughs> I don't know, there's, there's kind of a lot going on in this game. There's a lot of stuff you could do, a lot of optional stuff, like, you can play golf in this game. Uh, which is kind of fun. Which you, you wouldn't really expect. Just, like, looking at the type of game that it is, but there's all freaking golfing minigame mechanic that you can set up. Hello, buddy. Oh, god, you have, a, you have an arm- I like how the extended arms that they have have the torches in their hands. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, this is so much better. This is actually gonna take us down to the cave. I'm so glad I found this. This will actually get us into the jungle cave. Oh, hey. Eh, no, out, out, out of my life, out of my life. Oh god, there's gonna be so many bats down here. I find it kind of weird that jungle bats can spawn on the surface, but I guess it makes sense. I feel like they should be nighttime only, though. Just, just my opinion. Alright, radar. Uh, not the greatest, but I'll take it. Ooh, vines, nice. Got some of those, I don't need that. <laughs> this potion just has a 45 minute duration for some reason. Bottles, that's good, I'm keeping that. Oh, I should, I should buy another piggy bank and take that with me, so I can have extra storage. Uh, I think I already have this. In case I don't, I'm gonna bring it with me. I just hit that guy for one damage. Wow. <laughs> Do they really? Okay, it only does six damage. That makes sense. Yeah. Pickaxes are not meant as weapons. They're meant as mining tools. Alright, I think we've seen both of the... Actually, no, we haven't. Um, the Snatchers are the surface ones. Man-eaters are the underground ones. There's, like, there's two different enemies in this game that do the exact same thing, except one has more health. That's the only difference. And, the, and that's the Snatchers and the Man-eaters, the vines that attack you, that bite you from the ground. Alright. Lect. Thank you for the money. Apparently there's a lac beetle nearby. Oh, there it is. Those drop dye materials. I might pick that up. May as well. Did it go down? Uh, oh god, our first hornet. Oh, it, it was trying to find its way to me. And it did. Almost. There we go. Wait, who's that? Wait, I just saw red damage numbers here. Was that... Was that the goblin tinkerer? Did I just miss the goblin tinker? I guess I did. Oh, we'll find him. <laughs> I like how you can see it through the wall. It died inside the wall. Well, I'm not getting that whoopee cushion if there was one. Oh god. Oh, these hornets. These hornets are about to be a thorn in my side, just like the stingers. Or like a stinger in my side. Ooh, we found granite! Oh, I love that. 
I haven't found marble, so I don't think granite would be a very cool pool outline. We need to find a marble cave, and then we're talking. But granite is such a cool-looking block, I need to use this for something. I might, like, use it for, uh, underground cavern house later. Maybe next to the shimmer. I think it would look really good next to the shimmer. Here we go. Here's the boomstick. Um, yep, we're, we're taking it. <laughs> Let's freaking take it, dude. Ow, that's 42 damage. Oh, that's a problem. Yes, that was him. Swirly D has risen once more. Swirly Lightning. Nameless King, Gwyn. I don't need dart traps for myself. Oh god, that was the pressure plate. That was the pressure plate for the dart trap. Okay, I need to be careful with this because granite caverns are big. All right. I don't really know why I'm not jumping directly to taking all of the granite that I see and more, so I will get on that now. Uh, where's the granite going? Wait, is it, am I just like, am I just blowing this up permanently and none of it's dropping? Okay, no, there is. Oh, I just, I don't have enough room. <laughs> Took me a while to realize. Oh, man. Okay. Um, anything I can drink right now? Yeah, this. We'll drink the Night Owl Potion right now. Brighten this place up a bit. So, I've had... This is the best place I can say. I can just deposit video ideas that may or may not happen. Um, but... I have an idea of something I can do with Minecraft. I don't think I'm gonna be make it a stream. I'd rather actually have it be a video because uh, it would take forever. But I was thinking, do a Minecraft playthrough where I have to collect every single item in the game. And um, I, I don't know if I'm able to do that or not, but that's exactly why I wanna do it. I wanna see if I can. Every single item that is uh, obtainable in survival without cheating. Alright, let, let's go bomb this. Bombing it is so much faster. Die. 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 Seriously, freaking die, please. Thank you. Wow, we were here all night. Alright. Get out. Oh. Oh, you... Oh, you weren't dead yet. <laughs> I thought you were. Interesting th stream. Hmm, yes, three dots and a HUD. <laughs> is it... Are you unable to see anything at all? The granite caves are dark. That is that is very much true. Very interesting stream indeed, where yeah, I can't see anything at all in the game. That was my freaking... That was basically my Lethal Company stream. My last Lethal Company stream, where I had to go in without a flashlight. Because we were doing the challenge. Oh, God! Doing the quote challenge. It actually wasn't that challenging. In fact, it was easier. <laughs> I think it made the game easier. Genuinely. <laughs> I am falling way too far! Oh, God! Alright, well, um, we lived. And that's the important thing. We are intact. We found a granite crystal. We found a life crystal, not a granite crystal. I don't know what I'm saying. Alright, hopefully the rest of the jungle caves will be visible. This game can be surprisingly dark in areas, but I like that. I like that it's dark in areas. I might go. Might, might want to go back and see what that traveling merchant has before getting too deep into this and forgetting. Ooh, Goblin Ticker is nearby. He's right there! Hey, Gotcha! Okay, now we can reforge stuff. We can also buy rocket boots, which would be nice. Okay, that was bad. Okay. That was fine. We lived. Get. 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 Alright, we probably will max out our life crystals like this, because it's actually pretty- they're pretty easy to find down here in the jungle. There's nothing. Okay. Banner regen, I already have that. Um, is it better? No, it is not. So, off you go. I guess I could sell you. Uh, sure. No, don't drop that. Um... 
I want to drop anything mud blocks, probably. Feather fall? I could down that right now. That might be fun. Um, then invisibility. That could be good for another time. Perhaps I'll get rid of the bombs I can make sticky. Okay. Hold on. I'm messing around with inventory too much. Okay. Oh, great. <laughs> now I still have the chest afterwards. The zombie arm. We don't need that. I don't think it even sells for much. Oh, this Featherfall Potion is so nice, actually. I don't use Featherfall Potions enough. Wow. Yeah, boomsticks are good. <laughs> what can I say? Is that Crimtain? Is that a, just a single piece of Crimtain right there? There is. I'll take it, I guess. Um, I can't put that in my coin slot. Damn it. Aw, oh, man. <laughs> They're limiting me so much. Um... Take the builder potion, <laughs> I guess. Oh man, now I want this statue. We don't we don't need it. We can leave it down here. I'll probably come back later and then we can pick it up. Oh, but I need these jungle spores. Okay. Lead. I changed my mind. Don't leave. Um <laughs> This is where inventory starts to become a problem. No, wait. Excuse me. How'd I put that on? You're on, you're on PC and phone. Now only PC. Okay. Thanks for describing the transitional process. Hold on. I thought you could put these on in the accessory. Can you not put them on in vanity accessories? Oh, you can only put them on if you don't already have one. Okay. I, sure. <laughs> um, that's fine. I don't care about the sell price. Just get out of here. Oh, hey, you are bad. No, 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 no. Get in, get in you, get in you, get in you, get in you. I'd love to shoot this thing with meteor bullets, uh, but we don't have a meteorite yet. Right. Oh, abstractinator, that's pretty good. Gravitation potion, yeah, that's another thing I was planning on doing the stream, use, using these to go to space and get some fun stuff. Do I really need all these dirt blocks? Probably not. Um... I probably not gonna use boring chests. Finally, you can see more than three white dots. Good. Eventually, I'm not gonna need these jungle torches at all, but I think for now I'll get rid of rope. Okay, this here's a beehive. I'm gonna not go inside there for right now. That'll be for a later boss. Take that with me. I think I'll adopt it and take it with me. <laughs> Alright, anything down from here aside from more spores, which I will definitely take because spores are like kind of the main thing we're here for. We can make the blade of grass, the thorn chakram, the jungle armor, get some lots of real good stuff. Make Sandy House, but on the moon. I could do that. I need to find a fitting block to build the moon, though, because I obviously can't build it on the moon, but, like, I can build a moon to put it on, and then I can make it out of, like, the hardened sand or the sandstone. That might be fun. But that's for later, right? I, I don't think whatever blocks would be fitting are available right now. Spores, you made a... Spore mod for Mindustry with ChatGPT. Well, you could just make mods with AI now? Oh my god. A spore mod? Like, like the game spore? Alright, I don't care. Um, water walking potion. I'll throw out the lead for now. I think we have enough of that. Spore wasteland mod? Alright, I'm still not sure what that is. Not real, because you don't know how to code. You're right, it's not a real mod, it's made with AI. <laughs> Alright, uh, anyway. Jungle spores. Jungle spores. I think it's so funny that, like, apparently, ChatGPT started wigging out for a hot second. And then during that time, there were people from, like, companies who were, at the time, trying to replace all their writing with AI, like idiots. 
and then and they were like reaching out to actual writers. They're like, hey, we're now considering you for this job offer. That is the funniest thing. The idea is that after you leave uh, Serpulo, the spores take over, destroying all infrastructure, and you use spore tech to reconquer. You can you use the spores to conquer over the spores? That sounds great. <laughs> Actually, it does. Like, that, that's a neat concept. If that is what's going on, I don't know if it is. I'd like to get these spores and perhaps that crimtain. That crimtain looks good to me. Then we'll keep going down. I don't know why I'm so reckless fighting these guys. I just am. I'm just impatient. I'll take the money. I'll take more money. And then we'll keep going down. Uh, you drop stingers. I will definitely take you. And you drop vines, which I will need for more stuff. So I definitely need to backtrack a little bit here. Excuse me. Oh my god. You're so annoying. Your AI is really good, actually. It's like bouncing away from me at just the right moments. Right, you know what? You know what? You know what you get... Yeah, that's what you get. Fuck you. <laughs> oh my god, so annoying. You spore researcher, which researches spore tech with energy. It, it researches the energy into it. Uh, that's not what I wanted. I wanted the freaking... Thingy. Well, I guess there's a traveling merchant around, right? And I was gonna go talk to them before I continuing anymore. So let's stop here and go drop all the stuff off. Ooh, it's raining! No, it's not, it's not just raining, it's thunderstorming. Goblin Tinkerer, this is not where I want you. I want you in the snow biome, but of course I didn't tell you where to go, so... Fair. I'll put the Extractinator in this house. That's for, uh, extracting materials from, uh, silt blocks, um, desert fossils, and something else. Sand, I think, you can do it. So you actually have a use for, uh, some of that other stuff. There you go. Spore lab thingy which boosts the efficiency on the researcher. I agree that labs would probably boost efficiencies on researchers. That definitely checks out. I imagine you cannot research effectively without a, a good lab. Alrighty. Granite blocks, yeah, put the put the put these a freaking away. <laughs> Alright, and now. Oh yeah. I wanted to buy a piggy bank. So I have more storage. There we go. Um, I can take one of the bottles I got. Place it on somewhere to create a bottle crafting station. Like down here. That's a painting in the way, never mind. Um, that's a piggy bank in the way, never mind. Well, that's gonna be hard, isn't it? <laughs> Can I put it on a platform? Yes, okay, that'll work. Needs to be adjacent. Alright. Good, thanks for the tip. I'll be sure, I'll be sure to remember that it needs to be adjacent to the lab thing when I get that far. Alright. Uh... Oh yeah, this can go away. Then I would like to briefly take a detour to the snow biome to put the Goblin Tinkerer in his rightful place. And stacks giving each giving 20% efficiency. <laughs> by having a bunch of labs surrounded by surrounding a researcher, <laughs> they get more efficient just from having other labs. Not like they need to use them or anything. They just have other labs around them, they can do it. I'll give him the warm side. The mechanic will move in there later when we get that far. Excuse me. I'm sorry, I still have feather fall on. Where's the traveling merchant, by the way? He's at the desert. Okay. We gotta go to the desert before he disappears. He also put jokes in the description. <laughs> Good. I always imagine myself making mods like I want to make a mod for Terraria because why not right yep why not I want to make a mod for Terraria that makes a bunch of like small changes that I would have liked the game to have in it but again I also I, I mean I'm learning how to program 
but I don't really know how to go all the way and mod a game. What do you have? Ooh, Mysterious Cape for five gold. Dynasty Wood! Oh my god, I wish I had this earlier! I want to make the jungle houses out of this! Yeah, with like the blue dynasty. I think the dynasty wood looks best in the jungle. We can take some pod thai as well. I'll buy a bunch of dynasty wood, because this is good. There's also DPS meter. I think I'll pass on that for now. I don't think that's a terribly rare item of his. I'll get like 500 of that, 600, I mean. Then a few of these. This guy is the only way you can get these. And they look really cool. Perfect. I'll put them in house materials. And then we will head back with a pod tie in our belly. Not bad. <laughs> I also, you finished your level, but someone said not bad layout like it's easy to do. <laughs> I mean, I know why they're saying that. Did you leave the col the background colors default? I, I would imagine not, but you know. <laughs> you can put something in the description like, hey, this level's meant to be old style, this isn't a layout, it's just based on the original visuals of the freaking game. And then everyone will say, that sucks. Too close to dear nostalgists. Damage dash too hard to make this fancy stuff? I would agree with that. I do not understand that level editor in the slightest. I, ha I um, can't even imagine how long it takes to make some of that stuff. When, especially when you're not, like, a seasoned artist. Like, you have to be an artist to get your level super popular and well-known. And I guess that's just how Geometry Dash is nowadays. Like, if your level doesn't have a distinct visual style, like, nobody really cares. It's unfortunate that's the way that is. I don't like that's the way that it is, because I think a, a basic-looking level that's fun is better than a really good-looking level that's not fun. But, like... That's just, that's just how the community is. You change the colors, put color triggers, yeah. <laughs> if you left it all one flat color the entire level, then I would understand that comment more, but yeah. I mean, I understand it anyway, because it, it just appears that way on the outside. But also, yeah. <laughs> hey, at least, at least they called your level not bad. <laughs> I'd be lucky to have a level called anything more than trash if I tried to make a level right now on, on stream. <laughs> Which I am not going to do because, uh, yeah, it would just be, like, it would just be absolutely frustrating for any seasoned Geometry Dash player watching me mess with that thing having no idea what anything does. Ooh, Granite Golem, I think. No, that's a slime. That's not a Granite Golem at all. I want some of this granite, so I will take it. Making a platformer, desert theme, but I promised to yourself, make a boss fight. Ooh, good luck with that. I should play through the rest of the platformer mode in the base game. How fucking long is this poison? It's been on me for the past 30 freaking seconds. I'm pretty sure that it is. It's like 30 seconds. That's so stupid. I don't like that. Oh my god, expert mode. Why are you like this? Oh god. Drink. Oh, I'm. I am potion sick. Five, four, three, two, one. Perfect. <laughs> We're fine now. All right. Let's keep getting deeper. Oh. Wish I could go two seconds without one of you guys flying at me, but apparently it's too much to ask. <laughs> All right. Um. Well. Hmm. Um, yeah, mm-hmm. Um, this looks- this looks fantastic. This looks- What is that? Why is the jellyfish out of the water? <laughs> How'd that happen? This is the problem with the boomstick. If you're trying to shoot something from a long distance, it could just miss completely. Up close, though. Should be really freaking good. I ideally, it would be. How did that not- okay. There we go. <laughs> I love this song so much. It's from AM2R. 
case you don't want to dig through that huge cluttered list in the description to find out what song this is, which I could understand. I should have made that more organized. I organized it based off the soundtrack, and the soundtrack is ordered based on which tracks were added first and which came later and stuff. So it's a really weird order that's completely unconventional, makes no sense. 220, my god. Ooh, a coffee! Oh no, a spike slime! Oh god! There's a life crystal right there. I want it. I want it so badly. Uh, I need to box myself in real quick. Geometry Dash updated first on PC, later mobile. That means until Rob Top 6 the versions, you can't save mobile progress. Oh no. Interesting, because like, that game was started off as a mobile game, so I wonder why he's like prioritizing PC. Because I guess it's the more popular platform for the game, but still. Like, that game's identity is kind of in mobile, I would think. Alright. <laughs> I need to take healing potions, like, every two seconds in this godforsaken place. Stupid jungle. <laughs> would you believe me if I said the jungle gets even worse from this point on? Hi, didn't notice you there. I don't know if I've ever seen a dart trap with the projectile directly, or the pressure plate directly in front of it. Hello, honey. Hello, my baby. Hello, my honey. Hello, my ragtime gal. Got a natural pool and you'll be a sigma male. What does that mean? Natural pool? And then I'll be a sigma male? <laughs> what? Pool is huge. Oh god. He spawned. Out of the, the no 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 bad no bad awful oh hi minecart oh god awful no terrible stop game stop raining spike slimes for two seconds why did they just rain spike slimes on my head look to your right right of the cave um yeah if there was something up above well I'm I'm too far away from it now um well, I can go back up. I'm assuming that was a large pool to the right that I didn't see. Forgot that I actually want spike slimes right now. Can they do anything to me underwater? Ooh, chest, 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 gimme. Oh, there's... no. <laughs> actually, I'll, I'll pick that up. I'll adopt it and take that with me. Um, is our first buff out? Okay, no, it's not. I'm about to drown. There we go. I'm no longer about to drown. Oh my god. Can you not have a spike slime for two seconds? <laughs> oh good, the projectiles disappear in the water, so water is how you counter these guys. I already killed two of them, why'd you spawn two more, you stupid game? This double jump is like the only vertical abilities I have aside from hooking. Oh, this is what you're talking about. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's go over here. Looks good. I just accidentally zoomed in on the map. Hello, Classy Universe 3. Welcome in. Or, I know it's not a 3, it's an E. Whatever. <laughs> Welcome in. <laughs> How you doing? Alright, there's a moon glow. There's... Not a whole lot else, it would appear. Piranhas. There's a man-eater. That's one of the enemies I'm gonna find. Okay. A few jungle spores. That's good. I like to see jungle spores. Jungle spores are good. Um, I need stuff to kill things. I wouldn't expect shotguns to work very well on plants, but... That's yeah, surprisingly good. 
I love for you too. Your sunglasses make you look like a cool guy. They have sunglasses in their profile picture. I can't see. My screen's too small. Cause they keep it on the monitor next to me. Oh god. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. Crimtain. All right. Well, am I a Sigma male now? What does Sigma male mean? I don't even know. If it means something like bad in terms of offensiveness, then uh, I wish to not be that. I'm watching HD, but the monitor quality doesn't go HD. <laughs> so then it. It's probably like putting black bars on the side or something. I also don't know, but people say it's cool. All right. <laughs> I got dropped a hook. Those you can use to craft like the regular grappling hooks, but I'm not at all interested in doing that. All right, there's more water beneath me. I think we're done with this side of water. I got some spores. I'm about to get some stingers out of it too. That's about all I got, though. But the cla- Oh, you can't put it through walls. Good to know. I didn't know that, actually. I just thought I could put it anywhere I wanted on the screen. Oh! Tons of piranhas! Oh my god! Oh my god, look at all the freaking piranhas! I would say I don't want to kill them because of the spawn rate, but it's actually not really affecting the spawn rate that much. Oh! 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 I agree, character! Oh! Oh! <laughs> No! What the hell? How many things spawned when I wasn't around? Clearly like 70. Oh dear god, I hate spike slimes so much. Hey, five viewers, welcome in everybody! How you doing? Hope you enjoy me dying to jungle enemies. I just wanted to say you're great content creator, your content's amazing entertaining. We're gonna watch a dry stay. Thank you very much. That's always great to hear. Hope you enjoy your stay. Hi, and uh, welcome in. Joined Coco. How you doing? How'd y'all find this? This is just randomly recommended to you. So I would not be surprised if it is. Hello. That's a slime. I thought that was a turtle for a second, but that, we're not that far yet. <laughs> we don't have to worry about the turtles right now. <laughs> turtles are a problem for future us. Flower boots. Ooh, living the ho- Oh my god. I need to put this on the jungle house right now. Ooh, I should probably even replace it with living mahogany if it looks better. Motocon, bro. Also came here randomly, didn't I? Yeah, you did. Yeah, it was recommended randomly. Well, that's good. Good to know YouTube's actually doing its job. <laughs> in, you know, recommending videos occasionally. Because sometimes I just feel like YouTube is completely ignoring my videos. It's like, nope, these aren't going anywhere. Sli Slime is falling from the sky. Turtle flashbacks. Well, hey, welcome in, late. Ow! I wasn't looking. <laughs> uh, actually, I think I'm gonna... Go do that. I have enough stuff. I can go uh, fight the slime rain, and then we can fight King Slime. How about that? Perfect excuse to do so. Because otherwise, I don't know if I would have remembered to do this. Let's go. All right. It's getting flooded, both in chat and with slime in the game. Good thing the slime rain is actually really calm, so I can uh, take some time to put this stuff away. Uh, dump you in there, building materials. I'll try uh, replacing blocks with this, though I promise not to spend too much time house building this time. Because, man. King slime time, time to grind the slime. Yes, king slime time. It, it'll take a while, though. You need to kill like a hundred of them. <laughs> So for those joining and are confused about the music, this is a resource pack I have. <laughs> Welcome in, Terraria Enjoyer. I see you're in the right place. 
Uh, someone give me the shenanigans rundown? What shenanigans? Like, what happened on our playthrough? I don't know, we progressed. Like, I killed Eye of Cthulhu and Goblin Invasion. And that's basically it. That's all I've done. Nice houses? Thanks. I, I thought they looked kind of bad, but... I'm glad to know someone at least <laughs> thinks they're good. Because they're basically just wooden boxes with leaves on top, placed in ways that make it look more like an afro than an actual, like, branch leaf. Me seeing people plug fire in the hole. What, what you want to kill all of them so that you're the only one who can enjoy my content anymore? Is that what I'm <laughs> getting? Excellent. Yeah, there's definitely going to be more shenanigans in the future. This is our first shenanigan of the stream, I guess. Aside from all the freaking bees down in the freaking place. But yes, um, continuing what I was saying before. This is a resource pack filled, uh, that replaces the game's soundtrack with music from various games. Do you want to know what tracks replace what? Check the description. There's a lot of Chrono Trigger in there, some Super Mario Galaxy, a couple of pieces from Undertale, which I... Unfortunately, just most of Undertale's soundtrack doesn't really fit with this game that well, but I, there were a couple that did, so I use those. But those will not be coming until much later. But yeah. And the reason why I'm replacing is not just to make this playthrough a little different, but also because, if I may be honest, I'm not the hugest fan of Terraria's soundtrack. Because, like, over time, I've just kind of been like, this is not the greatest soundtrack in the world, but um, I'll stop right there before people start canceling me on YouTube. Before I've even started with my channel. 23rd of March, 529 subscribers, 24th of March, 1 subscriber. What? <laughs> Everyone's gonna look- Oh, <laughs> because you're you're trying to blow them all up, I see. I'm onto your plans, buddy. I I'm, I'm keeping a close eye on you now. Alright, well, hope you enjoy this 10 minutes of me just killing slimes repeatedly. I love how so many events in this game are like this. You just run around and kill everything that moves. Forever. And this is, like, actually... They somehow made it fun. I don't know how this game made just killing enemies repeatedly fun, but it does. It works super well for some reason. I was kidding, buddy. We don't need to fight. I'll believe it when I see... <laughs> I'll believe it when I see proof that you're kidding. <laughs> anyway. Hey, guys gonna spawn King Slime yet? Broke records of viewers? Honestly, I think we did! Eight! Is what it says on my end. Though I know that what it says on my end is not actually always accurate. Sometimes it said zero, but you were still in. None shall leave it. Yeah, yes, you are all you are all trapped here forever now. You must watch my stream, do nothing else with your life. What's that? You have an important game coming up? Like you play sports and you have an important game coming up in ten minutes? Too bad. You're watching me in instead. Nothing more fun than annihilating a bunny with weapons that could kill gods. I guess if that's what you consider fun? I don't know. I think I would rather annihilate a zombie or something actually monstrous. Welcome to nostalgic user. Um, remember campfires in Heartland for Region? Just good to have. True! I actually haven't built that many campfires at all. Um, I'm not crafting Heartlanders yet, because I don't have max life crystals. I usually do that after I get 400 health. But, yeah, campfires would be good to set up more of. Oh, I should also just expand this arena in general. You know, while I'm thinking of that. Yeah, let's go do it. I have a Bast statue, at least. How about... Yo. Yo. You? I have two, actually. I don't know if Bass statues stack, but yeah. We're gonna put these up. That should be good. Makes me want to hop on Terraria again. Sadly, there's no whole lot to do now. I've basically done everything in the game. Well, I haven't, because this is um, only my second playthrough, full playthrough of Expert Mode. I technically have another one going on, but I've kind of abandoned it, and so that's why I decided to try expert mode and stream instead, but yeah. I played this game loads. Most of it was on classic, though. You sound like a very experimented streamer. I assume you mean experienced. Don't say experiment or else you will get the apparatus. <laughs> You're right. What 
Extra Potion, nice! Just let her playing Terraria looking for something for background noise, lol. Who isn't a little silly? I don't know what that's in reference to. Um, I'm actually not that experienced when it comes to streaming. Videos, though! I've been doing this for like three years. Ah, here's King Slime. Okay, gotta focus now. Let's go, guys! King Slime! Every Terraria player was super excited to see me fight this boss. <laughs> and so they happened to hop on the stream at exactly this moment. <laughs> I really do appreciate having you all here, though, to witness this glorious event of killing a giant blob with a crown with a guy trapped inside of him. Okay. Oh god, oh rats, right, he spawns came he spike he spawns spike slimes, oh no. <laughs> okay, this might not go well uh, after all. Especially because slime rain will add extra slimes. Well, I think I need grenades. Let's get those in hand. Uh yo-yo's not gonna do shit. Okay, this is actually going really well. Like, the the spike slimes are kinda were kinda pushing me away earlier, but look at this guy's health. Oh man. Okay, and my health is yeah, pretty good. And every spike slime has fallen off now, so yeah, uh, we got this. I'll shoot the slime with the shotgun! I'd imagine the slimes would just absorb the bullets. There we go, and we got the nerdy slime from it, that's right. I, I haven't played 4.4 very much, so... 1.4.4. I like to call it 4.4 for the uh, sake of easy to, to say, but yeah, I forgot this guy just drops from it. There we go, we have a town slime. Oh yeah, I got a town slime off camera too. Uh, alright, let me catch up on this. Best statues don't stack. Okay, good to know. Uh, can you challenge runs if that sounds interesting? Challenge runs of this game? I could try. It would have to be classic, because I am not good at this game on Expert yet. That's what the stream- that's what these streams are trying to do. Alright. Ooh, we got two sets in the ninja set. Awesome. And then we have a solidifier now, and we have this now. Slimes have become friendly. Honestly, if spike slimes are one of those, putting that on right now. Get out of here, shoe spikes. Oh, I want that right now. Okay. Green slime banner. I'm gonna take you. Hey, buddy, you're friendly now. <laughs> That's so nice. Uh, I recommend putting it just outside each other's range to have the max extension. I'll probably do that when I expand the arena later. Plants in the pool, yeah, because we don't have uh, non-natural blocks. Um, the plants are going there. Expert deletes a defense for the funny. What? It does? What? Expert just stops bass statues from working? <laughs> I very much doubt that. That would be dumb. Remember your crimson rod? I sorta of did. Heat decreasing! Alright, nothing's more fun than committing gr uh, grenade kaboon on living slime. Victory. Alright. I'm officially caught up. Oh yeah, let's get pumpkins. I planted these, and now I have them. Cool, pumpkins. Uh, sure, I'll just I'll dump them in here and we'll do something later. I'm gonna need another dump chest before long. <laughs> Uh, potions can go in here. I don't need to- I'm not going mining right now. I'm just going for some, uh, fun stuff. Ooh. I, I kind of like the rain hat more, though. Let's put the ninja set in here, because I don't... Critical strike chance. Yeah, I don't know if I need that. Solidifier can go here. Slime hook. Is it better than this? It's a little faster, I guess. Yeah, it's faster. But it doesn't reach as far. I could go with it. I could put this in, uh... Here. I don't have a good slot for it. Alright. Back to the jungle! Back to the mission at hand! Doesn't literally delete defense. Uh, I've seen on master mode. You haven't seen on master mode negates defense. Oh, yeah. Actually, isn't it like defense... Your defense is made stronger on the harder difficulties. It's just that enemy damage is so high that it doesn't really do much for you anymore. I love the bouncy boulders they added. I have not played on those worlds yet, and they sound terrible. I, have, I haven't played on any of, like, the 4.4 world types either. I think I went on a Don't Dig Up world once just to see what it was like, and then I was like, this is this seems weird. I'm gonna leave now. Oh god, a Get Fixed Boy world would be terrible. <laughs> hey, after I after I finish this playthrough, if y'all want to see me try a Get Fixed Boy world, um... I guess I could. It would absolutely suck. I wouldn't like it. But I could do it. It's within the realm of doing. 
Your meme keeps getting ignored. Pink sl oh, I, I, yeah, I just didn't read it. Uh, pink slime fan femboy. Spike slime enjoy your giga chad. All right. I. So you're telling me that I, that if I accept Spike slime's existence and if I adore their uh, existence and all that, then I'm a giga chad. And that the Spike Slime hate that I've been giving in this stream has, uh, not made me look very good. Alright. I understand that. Uh, but also screw Spike Slimes. I don't care. I don't care what people think of me. <laughs> okay, I didn't think you would come out like that. Oh my god. <laughs> Just swinging at the wall. Ooh, ooh, Death Meter, yes! Awesome! Let's see how deep we are in the world. I like having those. It's not that information that I look for all the time, but it's just nice to have those. <laughs> uh, I see those other messages, but Terraria is being Terraria right now, meaning that I have to focus on killing alone, and I cannot do anything else. If I dare to stop attacking enemies for m more than a second, then I will pay with my life. Because that's how this game is. <laughs> on expert, anyway. Pink slime cute. Yeah, I agree. Um, anyway. Not gonna lie, I haven't touched my Master Mode world because of Martian Madness I was suffering through. Oh god, yeah. I think I've, I played Martian Madness on Expert. I could not kill the UFO. I think I gave up. <laughs> um, let me up about how funny a, a boulder can be. Are you mad at me? Oops! Uh, you might be now. I'm gonna escape. <laughs> oh god, get away from that. I didn't mean to do that. Um... Small cave, you're dead. That's all there is to it. You're subscribling. Thank you for subscribling. Uh, Terraria's defense is weird. Classic must attract damage 50%. Yes. Yeah. Uh, 50%, 75%, then 100%. Uh, you're close to the telephone with that death meter. Yeah, true. 10 watching? Oh, man. I haven't seen numbers like this since... Ever. Literally. <laughs> since I started streaming. Because I started streaming, like, last fall. <laughs> And I've made a ton of streams since then. Which is weird to think about. It's like, I made, what, six Lethal Company streams? Doesn't feel like I did, but I certainly did. Alrighty. Did you do that? Are you Are you like, are you following along and gonna laugh at me for everything I do? Oh, are you unfriendly with me if I do that? Because I just did it again. No, you're not! Awesome! Let's take this minecart. Just kidding, it was my phone account. Wait, it wasn't. <laughs> uh, Alright. Mixed messages coming from that. Coming from that. I'll oh, get out of here. Get shotgun blasted into death and stuff. Okay, I might want to go fight Brain of Cthulhu in this stream so we can get a meteorite so that I can have good stuff have some good armor. Though I am, like, on the way to jungle armor, which I should be able to make really soon. I've been collecting lots of spores. I'm happy to give tips. Well, I may or may not need them, but, like, I am not too experienced with expert mode, so it's possible. And, uh, you might also be able to remind me of something. So, yeah. Go ahead. But, like, if you must know, I browse this game's wiki all the time whenever I'm bored in class. <laughs> I'm just like, okay, this, this is all a bunch of stuff I already know being taught. Let's go to the Terraria wiki and scroll on random pages so I know a bunch of random things about this game. That I wouldn't have otherwise. Oh god. Okay, excuse me. <laughs> Please die. It felt so good to actually go into the jungle caves on my first ever playthrough and actually be able to conquer them, because my first experience with jungles was that I would walk into them and then die to the nearest bat within 10 seconds. I know, right? So relatable. Welcome in, Polar Void. Is that sarcasm? <laughs> if it is, well, I can't help myself. I just love browsing wikis. I should make a wiki tier list for, like, <laughs> how good a game's wiki is. Terraria would be S tier for sure. That wiki is so good. And welcome in Pickle. Is this Terraria? No, it's not. This is actually 2D Minecraft. 
I'm actually having fun watching this and thinking about the mayhem of talking you into playing the Calamity. Oh no. Um, <laughs> you know, you only need to smash an orb heart to activate a Goofy Meteor to spawn. No? You, you need to kill the boss now. I thought. It, or is the boss like a guaranteed meteor? And breaking a orb can get one to randomly happen. Because I thought you had to kill the boss to get a meteor to drop. It's not sarcasm, true. One second, read your stream on my PC. Uh... I've tried to swing at this guy in front of me. <laughs> this is clearly Blockheads. <laughs> Anyone here know about Blockheads? There's this little Minecraft-like game on mobile. It was 2D, but it wasn't Terraria. It was very far from Terraria. There were only, like, two enemies in the game. To play that one Minecraft mod called Escape and Run Parasites, to be honest. I would if I knew how to mod Minecraft. I still don't. I mean, I, I could probably figure it out. Like, there's... You download a mod loader, you download mods to go with it, you put them in, you play the game, you have fun. Oh my god. This is my first experience with, like, a chaotic chat full of messages that it's hard to keep up with. I might not be able to read every single one, so sorry guys. Favorite biome is the jungle. I love building nature, builds like trees and bushes and foliage. It's a nice, something so nice to do every once in a while. However, mostly build in journey mode. Since, uh... I would imagine because of the, uh, increased block placement range you get. Jungle's the hub for such builds. I really like the jungle, too. I mean, you're- you're kind of forced to like the jungle because so many things are in it. It's so important for so many things. Like, you compare the jungle to the desert, and, like, the- the desert caves never need to be visited, ever, to finish the game. Hey, we have a living mahogany tree down here. <laughs> the reason I love it. For the stage I've gotten to is stage force of escape and run? Makes sense. Took 83 Minecraft days. Well, that sounds awful. I hate the desert so much. I kind of do too, especially in hard mode when they need to lower the spawn rate of Dune Splicers. I don't know. I can't remember if they did in 4.4, but uh, I, I hope they did because my god, they were ridiculous. <laughs> They just never stop coming. Open mouth, yeah, yeah, comment as much, yeah, yeah, so I'm a Cito gets crazy, so I'm a Cito gets crazy. I'm sure that's a song. It's just annoying. Except that turtle, I hate the <laughs> Yeah, the, the one bad thing about the jungle caves, the turtle. And you know, uh, expert mode in general. That's another thing I can say. Though maybe I hate expert mode jungle because of the turtle, yeah, I don't know. Expert mode, hard mode. God, this game is so weird with the hard mode thing, anyway. Anklet of the Windy! I have an aglet too, I think, so we can get lightning boots before long. I should go buy rocket boots from the dude soon. I'm gonna need those for lightning boots. Let's have some coffee. And throw out the rich mahogany, I don't need it. Holy shit, 12. Hi, everybody. How's it going? My name is Omencito, and I'm here playing Terraria for ya. I like how I pronounced Terraria the way you're supposed to earlier, and I just didn't bring attention to it. I said Terraria. Um... For some reason. <laughs> Even though I, I like to say Terraria, that's just how I pronounce it. There's- a, is this another living tree? Oh my god! Well, it didn't read my sentence, well I'm sorry, there's kind of a lot of happening in chat. Uh, <laughs> Turtle is giving me PTSD for all jungle-based biomes and games. Turtle's going murder sprees when you're there. Legit a blue shell. I mean, the ones in ice are. Coffee? Can I have? Um, I've got two more cups. You want one? I can send it over. Those turtles are also br brutal. You just trying to cross the jungle in hard mode. <laughs> True. The derplings are, uh, quite tough. Another minecart track. Alright, we're getting deep. Staff of Regrowth, very nice. Oh yes, I wanted to do this. Man, this game just becomes like, so many things you want to do but don't have the time, but can't figure out which order to do them in Simulator 2011. I never sold this. Well, I guess it's being thrown out then. Seeds, I don't need them. Um, Silver Bar, don't need. Um, spiky Balls, don't need. 
Staff of Rego. Five of some inventory. Um, here. Piggy Bank. No space to put Piggy Bank. God damn it. <laughs> Alright, drop you. Pick it up. And then, pick up Piggy Bank. Put it down. Yep. You can't put it down there? Hold on. You can't. You have to put it on a thing. Okay. Now, uh, dump this. This. Actually, no. Dump the blocks. The stuff I forget about. The stuff I don't care about. Yeah. Alright. Good enough. Might want to clean your inventory. <laughs> Probably. I don't know. This is just how I play these games. I just keep going deeper and deeper and deeper, even though my inventory is, like, stuffed to bursting. My backpack's trying to fall off my bag. My backpack is ripping open. All the stuff content is spilling everywhere. But I'm still just like, what's this way? Hmm, instead of going back home to drop it off. That's just how I do. And, uh, that's what I am doing. Alright. I hope I have enough vines and stuff to create the stuff I want to stuff create. Crafts. Create stuff. You know, all those things. Master Bro Turtles basically Dungeon Guardians that can't go through walls. Ice Rod moment. Hello, welcome in. Uh, I mean, I did the same thing. Original open mouth. Okay. I still do not decide to clean my inventory. ADHD gaming. <laughs> I'd never reforge like that, honestly. Budget reforging. Ah! You're talking about- you're talking- I was just, like, thinking through that in my head earlier for some reason, like, Oh, yeah, that's right, you can reforge with Shimmer! We have yet to find Shimmer, uh, in this playthrough, but that will be good find. I will definitely look for that in the future. Alright. Now I think- Ooh, but I wanna- but I wanna see where this goes, but I wanna- but- but I don't- but I also wanna drop stuff, but I also wanna see where this goes, but I also- mm, oh my god, there's so many things I wanna do, but also, I- there isn't- <laughs> Bizarre! Give me immune to that poison! Oh, what can I replace it with right now? I probably don't need this, for right- uh, for the time being. Let's put them on as, uh, vanity, though. I love minecart tracks, but way too many enemies can spawn near them. Alright, um... Does it feel weird talking to yourself with people at the same time? Sort of. It felt weirder when I was first getting into it. I mean, I don't know. When I was first getting into recording videos, it felt weird to talk to myself. But streaming just kind of came naturally to me, and I'm not sure why. Find Shimmer, same side you're on now. Yeah, I know that. Um, throw stuff you don't want in lava. Good idea. <laughs> Knowing this guy knows Baldy VR is crazy? I, I do? <laughs> Who are you talking about? <laughs> Terraria Minecraft just filled me with the intense need to explore with my... Yeah, whenever I'm in a post-1.18 Minecraft cave, I get so lost to the point that I just have to dig up and out to the surface, because I'm like, I have no idea where I came in from, because this place is massive. Alright, the music has looped for, like, the third time now. I think that's a surefire sign I need to get out of here. Hold on. One more chest. One more chest. Cloud in a bottle? Sure. I can actually take that. I can actually take all this. Wow. Uh, I can't take this, though. There we go. Alright! Alright. Prepare yourselves. Oh, it's so nice to <laughs> quick stack everything away. It's like you're freaking taking a weight off your shoulders. Reaper statue. I'll put this next to the death's chest. There we go. I haven't died so far. Terraria? Mm, overrated. I like the game, but definitely overhyped. I disagree with you there. This is like my favorite game ever. <laughs> Very close. Not important to get permanent buffs as now, probably. Sure, but like, if I want to get them... I... <laughs> I mean, like, as soon as I find it, that's gonna be the first thing I do. But I don't know. I'm not gonna do that yet. Talk to myself daily, but... You're getting touched, buddy. Okay. Nearly at 69 minutes and start. Nice! Cloud in a bottle goaded. Well, I have a blizzard in a bottle, and I think that's better. Yeah, cloud in a bottle gives me that little bump. I have feather fall on right now, so it's actually hard to tell what it's doing. But blizzard in a bottle lets me, like, go up for longer, so I think I kind of prefer it. I'll put this away for now, though. I don't need those. 
Maybe I do, actually. No, I do. Let's put him on the banners. Or on the platform over here, on the arena. In case another slime rain happens. We need extra defense and damage against slimes. For hard mode, actually. That might be good. Base is so much better than anything I usually make. Honestly, same here. Although, I usually just make these wooden box houses. I just decided to add the trees and stuff this time for the sake of, you know, making actually something interesting. Oh, let's put this down. On top of something, like here. There we go. In case I want to make any honey stuff. Oh, shoot. I don't have a boss's chest, do I? I do not. Here. Extend platforms. I can't. What the... What do you mean I can't extend platforms? Sorry, the sawmill was in the way. What? The sawmill is not that tall. Come on. <laughs> All right, whatever. Well, then where do I put the sawmill? I want an, I want room for another chest that I can put bosses in. Um. That can be, like, for a smaller... Here, whoa, wait, 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 wait. Perfect. You can place that royal gel thingy with, uh... Cloud in a bottle. Slimes are not that big of a deal, honestly. Well, spike slimes are. That, I was mainly putting on for spike slimes. That's right, you can actually... I totally forgot you do this. Well, I guess for the next stuff... Yeah, I don't... For what I want to do next, which is actually to go, um, and go to space. I don't need that. So, yeah, let's go to space. Let's get a bunch of, uh, good stuff. Royal Gel Super Rifle for Building Wall Flesh Arena. Uh, otherwise this do good on its own. I feel like, I really feel like it's great for the jungle because of Spike Slimes, but you all do what you all. Get a balloon. Oh, yep. Let's go do that. Oh, man. Oh. You know what? Fuck you. <laughs> Get out of my life. We're going to space. Enjoy Super Mario Galaxy music. I have a friend that bullies me into making nice looking houses at the beginning of playthroughs. I tell him to go fetch me the materials. <laughs> Stop making useful comments so my jokes get covered. Hey man, I'm sorry. I... <laughs> I have no control over this. Number 15. Burger King Foot Lettuce. The last thing you want in your Burger King burger is someone else's foot fungus. That's as far as I know. Oh, no, go back up. I feel like I don't use gravitation potions enough outside of this. Like, I think they could make some really fun stuff for mining. Like, the Wanda Sparking uh, YouTuber apparently puts on... Ooh, gri red balloon, there we go. What is that? Oh, it's a painting. <laughs> Love is in the trash slot, okay. I'll pick these up, these are good. I might also want to just destroy this house in general for these blocks, because these blocks are cool, and I don't know if you can make them otherwise. Actually, I think you can. Never mind. We don't have to. I'm start master mode for the worthy world and play alongside the stream. Ooh, good luck with that. I will not touch for the worthy with a 10-foot pole. Um, jump scares. Oh, you watched the... Ah, you watched my... Th that old video I made forever ago about, like, why is my Baldi's basic drum scare sound different? Yeah, that was before I even did commentated playthroughs. That was a while ago at this point. I remember making that. I like how that's my most popular video of everything else I've made. Stop playing rip-off Minecraft. Alright. <laughs> I'll go play rip-off Terraria instead. I can't believe they actually tried to make Terraria 3D and then, like, give it not as much content. Am I right, guys? <laughs> <laughs> Try and get a Star Fury? Well, I, I that's what I'm going for. I'm going for all the chest items up here. There's Balloon, Star Fury, something else. Can't remember. Horseshoe. Level double Big Mac, pickles, cheddar, meat, and ketchup, large fries with six nuggets. All right. Um, would you like any, <laughs> would you like any sauce with that? How often do you stream? Welcome Insight Seer, once a week. I'm thinking like, right now I'm thinking every Saturday I stream. I don't stream anymore often, hey, 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 wait, 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 town slime, town slime, town slime, give me, give me your, give me your soul, yes! <laughs> Bye, <laughs> have a nice fall. Star Fury, there we go. Blessing from the heavens, I will take this chest too. So keep going this way. How low am I? I'm pretty low. Huh. I'm Pickle. You've just realized this about yourself. You were actually a Pickle all along. 
I know, right? What do they do with all the bosses when they made Terraria 3D? It's boring. <laughs> they made this one called, like, The Wither. And it sucks. <laughs> Go lower and you will find islands. I don't know, sometimes they could spawn up here, I think. But I guess I, I I do kinda go a little bit too high when it comes to islands. I just I like floating around up here. It gives me more time to enjoy the nice atmosphere of space. Oh, oh, hey, hey listen, guys, guys, hey, let's li guys, hey, hey, listen, guys, hey, guys, hey, listen. <laughs> Stop. Please. You were so annoying. Wish I could play with you, sadly my Wi-Fi sucks. Uh McDonald's Wi-Fi daily with no mercy. I miss multiplayer. Are you able to play with other people, like, just across the internet from anywhere? Because if so, that's so freaking cool. And that's yet another plus this game has over Minecraft, just straight away. <laughs> just straight up, in terms of usability and convenience. Enter my burger now, please. <laughs> I gotta find some wings or try to make the bundle of balloons. I don't know if I want to make the bundle of balloons. That's never something I go for, but, like, I guess. I don't know if my... I think... Do you need a sandstorm in a bottle for that? Because you need balloons combined with other stuff for that. And so I think you would need a, your world to have a desert pyramid. And mine doesn't seem to. I haven't been to the desert that much. Okay, this sucks. Okay, this sucks. Okay, this sucks. Okay, this sucks. Can you heal, please? Thank you. Alright. Not really finding anything else, though. I am sticking up high. These harpies are getting on my nerves. They're also- okay. We're at the ocean. We can despawn all the harpies. Finally. Alright. Got a friend of mine steamer host a dedicated server. Oh yeah, that's what I thought. But like, once you are friends, you can just connect anywhere. Which is so freaking cool. I like that. I just- I never tried doing it. Because I don't play this game multiplayer very often. But, yeah. Just curious. Bundle of- Balloons is legit wings, but for the poor. Trust me, bro. For the poor. If there are many wings, they're pretty easy to get in hard mode. I don't know if it's for the poor. It's just for the people who haven't progressed that far. Alright. Shiny red balloon. I guess I can take off band of regeneration as much as it's been helping. I just saw my regeneration slow way down the instant I, the instant I do that. I did that. Here, have some coffee. Right. Potions... Hope you guys like me rummaging around my houses, because my organization is not the greatest. Ooh, clouds could make a cool house. If I want to make a house in space, I don't know if I do, though. Let's put some actual things down here, like this. And then... This. And then... This. And, uh... This. This. And I still have more, god darn. <laughs> God darn it. Don't you diss our beloved balloons. Wings are easier, more convenient, but balloons could be good burst movement. Make a space station. Well, that's an idea. Here, you know what? There we go. Hopefully I'll remember to mouse over that on occasion. Uh, water chest, you become water chest. Then... Horse chest can become skyware. Water chest. I like potions being water chest. Then, uh, accessories can become skyware as well. There we go. This is something I like to do. I like to upgrade my um, chests as we go. Ooh, which, which one would be better? You know what? I'm going to keep... Oh, but 25. Hmm. I think I'm going to use Star Fury instead of Ruby Staff for now. We'll see how that goes. And you all come out and be quick stacked away. Thank you. Um, staff of regrowth. That's something else. God, okay. Put that in weapons. We'll worry about it later. Alright. Make an apple? You make apples? I don't know how to do that. Some seeds are just gonna keep flying for no reason, or be able to make something to land on in space. I can't put blocks down up there. I was just looking for floating islands for items. Maybe a storage room underground? I'd like my storage to be in a more reachable area, and that means on the surface, usually. I just remember that that guy's friendly and I didn't need to kill him. I'm so sorry. What I probably need to do is expand it. Because, like, those chests are not enough. I need to make more specific chests. Alright, we're going to check the other side of the world because I want that horseshoe. No fall damage would be great. Start building for blowing islands, right? I can. I'm just... I'm not... 
like planning on doing that yet necessarily, but that could be a, a project for later. I feel like all these streams are going to be me saying, hey, I've been thinking of doing this thing. I think thinking of building this and then not actually building it and I'm saying that over and over until the game is over. At the end, we can count up all of the things that I said I would try building and then didn't build. Bunny murder? That was a slime I killed. I haven't murdered any bunnies. I should buy the critter companionship thing so that I don't kill bunnies. If I did kill a bunny, I just didn't notice. Sorry. Alright, well this one's just a lake. Uh, we'll have to remember this if we want to do any space fishing. Which I haven't done fishing quests for Angler either. I was trying to do those so I could get stuff like Enchanted Sundial so I could skip those, those stupid annoying solar eclipses. Alright, here's Island. This should have Horseshoe. I can also collect the trees from it, honestly. And I think I will. It has Celestial Magnet. Since when do these things have Celestial Magnets? That was must be a 4.4 change. I, I thought... These were found elsewhere in the game. Alright, I'll take it, I guess. Um, very odd, though. Space Station. I said I would do that later. I, I like to keep the floating islands as they are right now. For right now. Minus some trees. But, uh, you know. Close enough. Please die. Also, the space station village will be super annoying to be in in hard mode because there's wyverns spawning all the time. Though, if I put NPCs up there, there shouldn't be. Oh god, hey listen, hey listen. Please, thank you. You can use celestial magnets to build on sky? No, that's for uh, increasing the pickup range for mana stars. Love fishing for materials. The name is suggestive. What name? Oh god. Okay, well, I should keep going. Because I'm about to run out of this gravitation potion, and I want that horseshoe! I'm so glad we got the pink moon on this world. Alright, I'm gonna bump into that harpy. Excuse me. Excuse me, harpy. Excuse me, harpy. Oop, oop. Floating island. And... Cool. There it is. Finally got it. Finally got what I was after. Okay, now... Ooh, I want this. Give me this. Alright, I also have the, uh... Crafting station. Or... Nope, that's not what I meant for making one of this stuff, so I'm gonna have to put that down. Sky Mill. I'll put that, uh, th here. No. Um, fine. Where can put... Perfect! <laughs> uh, alright. Now we put that there. Fletching Wings occurred early flight and Slowfall found in Sky Island's chest. Unfortunately, I didn't find any. <laughs> so maybe there's one that I missed. We can go without them for, uh, though. That's okay. No, not there. That's I wanted to move one block over. Thank you. Okay. Put a feather away. Oh my god. How am I gonna do this now? I know I'm gonna do this now. I'm gonna go visit the Goblin Tinkerer and buy a freaking Tinkerer's Workshop so I can actually combine accessories. Cute yellow slime? Yeah, I agree. Imagine Lucky Lucky Horse who healed you for taking fall damage, yeah. Do I have that? Is that what I have? No. I remember having a Lucky Lucky Horse at one point. Oh, that is so nice having two double jumps, actually. Why are those stars going way over those guys' heads? Hello, sir. Oh, I meant to add a door here. 
Um, well, that'll have to wait, I guess. Let's buy... Oh! One person in the previous stream wanted me to get the mini shark. And I have enough gold for it now. If I want to buy the stuff, then I have to... Then I have to spend, like, all of it. It's fine! It's worth it! That's all I wanted, so Tinker's Workshop should go somewhere. How tall is it? Pretty freaking tall. Could it fit there if there were platforms? Yes, actually. Okay, didn't really expect that. Alright, accessories. Let's get y'all let's get y'all out. Wait, where, where's my balloon? Oh, I have it on. <laughs> I didn't notice. So I can... I can combine it with a bottle. Oh, I have to combine it with a bottle first before I can get... Okay, let's do that then. That's right. I'm, I'm having to remember all this stuff because it's been a long time since I played this game and gone through all this. I'm having to remember how you actually combine stuff. Where's the... Oh my god. I, I seriously have to jump to get this? I cannot wait until I find that bread. Levels in my old Geometry Dash account got berated, but it's pointless since I've got the email for it and the password. Oh no. Hello, Christina Goldsmith. Welcome in. How are you doing today? I have... Okay, this is warding. This is actually kind of good. Um, I don't know if I... Okay. Now I think I can put the horseshoe on it. No, hold on. There it is, okay. But... I want to make bundle of... Bundle of horseshoe balloons. Okay. So never mind. Oh, but... Okay. I need a sandstorm in a bottle. So the amount of times I've heard buy many shark as soon as possible has driven me insane. Uh, not that it's bad though. Yeah, I haven't tried using it that often. I still have email. Should I waste my time trying to regain access? Uh, that's up to you. Okay, so I... If I make it like this, I guess you can't... Can I still combine the horseshoe balloons after I've already come into this? After I've already made the horseshoe balloon? Hold on, wiki time. You're gonna, y'all are gonna hear nothing for a while. Cause I need to see this bundle of horseshoe balloons. I almost said shoe horse. Never mind. Okay. There's multiple ways to make it, and you can indeed make it with that. Cool. You can. Alright, then we'll go ahead and make this. I wonder if some of that stuff was added in 1.4.4, because I don't remember that being in the recipes like last I looked. Alright, we don't need two of those. Private banner can go up there. I'll probably replace those with NMP banners later. Uh, let's get you so we can make Spectre Boots. Yeah, now we can do this. Ooh, <laughs> very nice. And with this, we can go crazy with it, and even block fall damage. Yeah, now we- now we have jumping. Now we can actually jump. Nice to be able to jump. A gold squirrel in there, just chilling by itself. The silence. Last I verified it did, but I don't know. Horseshoe bundle is uh, 1.4 by 4. Uh, the, the, yeah, the, the horseshoe bun uh, bundle of horseshoe balloons. Good to know. I'm not lying. Okay. If I make it this deep and I don't find a pyramid, is there a pyramid in this world then? <laughs> I don't know. Where to next is the question. I think I'd rather go to regular caves again, because this was a fun jungle excursion. Wait a minute, wait a minute, before I go there, though. We got the stuff. Let's see what we can make with it. Oh, we can make stuff with it. We can make good stuff. All right. I think I want to go with jungle set. It'll not only be an improvement to defense, but magic weapons. You know, well, look at all the magic weapons I'm using here. It's so, it's, it'll be so helpful. Oh, Ivy Whip, I love that, yes. Um, okay. The Blade of Grass is no longer an option. Oh, well, we can worry about that later. Why is it not an option? Hold on. Fifteen-three. Oh my god, I'm missing one stinger. Be right back! <laughs> I'm missing one stinger! Let's go kill one hornet and do this. Oh boy, the agility is going up, yes. If you want quicker turn speed and the magiluminescence, right. Alright, so I have two options from here. I can go back down to caves, or I could go fight the evil biome boss first. I think I might want to go fight, uh, Brain of Cthulhu 
first, so I can not only get some, some more of those Crimson Heart items, but that'll unlock a lot of stuff, so... YouTuber cat demontation, eye profile picture, uh, denomination would be grateful for you in this next livestream media transponder. Make a cosmic station of multitask, aka space station. <laughs> sure. If we don't do it this stream, we'll do it next stream. I can always end off this stream by doing that. Ow! Hey, you there. Hey, that was mean. You wanna know what I do to you? That's what. Give me that stinger. The one stinger that I needed. <laughs> Let's make the blade of grass now. There we go. <laughs> okay, that should be better than ten- Well, I would think it is. Yeah, it's probably better, because it has bigger range. Yeah, let's go with that. Let's put this away. As good as this was, and there's a really good modifier, too. Oh, massive. Uh, yeah. Oh, why didn't I switch this off yet? I don't know. Now I have. There we go. Where to store armor? I guess in here. I like to put it in the dresser. Play slime hook with it. Trash slime hook, honestly. Or maybe sell it to someone. Because I always forget to sell stuff to people. There we go. Quick stack everything else. Get rid of you. And now, uh, let's go see about that there brain. Your base shape is sus. What? <laughs> Actually, it looks like a little guy with two legs down here and arms. <laughs> but do, do you see an Among Us in there? <laughs> I have right now? What is? Let me go sell this one then. I have duplicates. Sell it to the slime. The slime will take it. You're demolitionist. You want this? Right. I need to make a pile on in this direction. Like okay, I ended last year, I stream making pool. Well, stream before that, you mean. Highest pre boss defense as well. Oh, good to know. Well, I've killed the boss, so now it's not. <laughs> I think that. Oh, but Shadow Armor, yeah, right, you need, or Shadow Armor, or whatever the Crimson one is, uh, you need the other thing to make. Hello, Blue Slime stuck in the floor. <laughs> That's too innocent to see what I saw. I'm not that innocent. Nah, I'm kidding, I kind of am. Yeah. Wait, I'm stupid. Tissue samples aren't for swords. Oh my god. Oh, that chilled. Oh, I hate that. Oh. Oh my god. It's making it this far in the game really makes me start to hate the chilled because it makes you so agonizingly slow. Oh my god. <laughs> I forgot how it was like. All right, best not best not to say that. You can leave it at stupid. <laughs> Not that I'm saying you are stupid. Because I'm sure you're not. Hello. I'm just gonna kill him like this. I'll just sit right here. Just, you know. Four, 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 three, eight, four, 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 five, four, four, four. <laughs> that was actually kind of fun. Yeah, this sword is so much better than technical spike, because it because it reaches farther. Just to show damage isn't everything. Wish I knew that in my first playthrough. I think there were some weapons I would have liked, but I threw them away because it doesn't do as much damage. Red biome time, indeed. Also, what do you mean by tissue samples? Is that an item in this game? <laughs> I actually can't remember for some reason. God, I used to know so much about this game, and now look at me. I've fallen off so far. Do -do -do -do. This biome looks mighty edible. I think this biome thinks that the world looks edible. I don't know if I would want to eat the spiders here. I guess I could see the appeal though in the blocks and stuff. I can't remember how Brain of Cthulhu is to fight on Expert. I don't know if my first Expert playthrough was on a Crimson World, so... Fine, looks like it considers you edible, that's what I'm saying. Oh, the Ivy Whip is so freaking good, holy crap. I find it funny that there's a hook in this game called Whip. Yeah, when whips are actually, like, a, a thing elsewhere. Is there a... No, I thought there was a crimson worm. 
But that's corruption I'm thinking of. Oh no. You stop it. I wouldn't imagine the Crimson Rod would do such a great job against these guys, but what do I know? Okay. Do, 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 do. What killed- oh, the, <laughs> the Crimson Rod! <laughs> it actually came in handy! Thanks, Crimson Rod! Wall of Flesh is when? I actually don't know progression try. Wall of Flesh is much later. Like, I'm planning to clear out basically like every option on boss in pre-hard mode, and that's gonna take a while. So, Wall of Flesh is n not for a long time. Because that's, that's when you enter hard mode, the next stage of the game where it goes crazy and the rest of the content is available. God, I love hard mode. I want to make a video just like praising hard mode for how awesome it is as a game feature, because I fucking love it. Like, it's such a genius way of increasing the difficulty in a game like this. After beating this boss, the entire freaking world is different! Brain of Cthulhu is actually weak to things like grenades. Also, who made the Terra Prisma beat the hell out of, uh, Brain of, Cth Brain of Cthulhu's not back? Well, um... I mean, the Terra Prisma is your reward for beating, like, the ultimate challenge of Terraria. So I would imagine that it does well against a pre-hard mode boss. That's why it abuses the hell out of their knockback. Oh shit, we were one away? I forgot. Okay, well, I guess we're getting into this right away! First attempt! Let's go! You there are- oh my god, you're annoying. Let's get grenades out, like that person suggested. Uh, I have a Crimson Rod set up already. Everyone- no! No spiders! No spiders allowed! I think this will do really well, actually. Oh wow, look at that. Yeah, it's doing well. It's doing well. Oh. Yeah, because this thing's like flinging stuff at them. It's poisoning them. <laughs> Look at that number at the bottom. It's going down. It's yelling timber. Ow. All right. Um, shotgun will be good as well. Boomstick. Let's pick up hearts. I think we're going to kill this guy for sure. All right, here we go. This is the only boss in the game that takes knockback. Oh, we so got this guy. Oh, my God. He's going to try to confuse us, but that's fine. I won't be confused, because you could just look on the map. Actually, he doesn't show himself on the map. Oh, they changed that. Oh, okay. <laughs> Good to know. Uh, where is he? Oh, my God. I totally didn't know that he hid himself on the map now. Where? All right. You can kind of figure out, based on, like, where are they moving how they're moving around you, but also you kind of can't, and it's hard, and I, it was actually harder than I thought it would be. That's fine. Well, we got it. Kind of, I might want to break a few more, though. Don't want to use the Crimson Armor after this regen. It's going to help you big time. That's right, it has a regen ability. Poison Proco Brr. No, the Terra Prisma is something you find in Titanium Crates. No, it's not. Oh, the Terra Grim. Well, the Terra Grim is super rare. Like, it's, it's literally, you have to, you either have to play Tell Us Celebration Mark 10 and buy it from the princess, because how else are you going to freaking get it on the rest? You have to find a super rare item in the world, break it, and have like a 5% chance of it dropping. I would expect the, to be rewarded for my efforts with that. Yeah, this is better. Pick that up. Ooh, Brain of Confusion. Oh yeah, this is good, isn't it? Okay, we got tissue. Oh, that that's where you get tissue samples. There we go. You can tell I haven't played in a while. Sort of. <laughs> the Terra Prism is the Empress of Light Daytime reward. Only comes from Sor Sorcha. 2% of God. Worse than I thought. I'm so glad you can buy that from the Princess, because it's a weapon that sounds kind of fun. It, on Celebration Mark 10 Worlds. Um, it's a weapon that sounds kind of fun, but I've never gotten the chance to use it, because it's just so freaking needlessly rare. I hate it. <laughs> Alright, gonna bomb one more thing. Hopefully get something like a Crimson Heart. Or Panic Necklace, that's actually what I was thinking of. I didn't mean to say Crimson Heart. And, uh, should we kill him one more time to ensure that we have the materials for the armor? I think so. I've always had to kill the bosses multiple times, uh, to get all the materials for that stuff. And we know we can kill it, so yeah, let's just do it. Where... Where's another Crimson Heart? 
Terragrim is honestly OP. I would hope it is for how rare it is. Uh, nothing down there. I'm assuming it, it probably stops becoming OP in hard mode. Are, am I out of Crimson Hearts down here? So much content in Terraria, we're bound to confuse some things. Oh, yeah. This game was so overwhelming to get into, because I was like, how many weapons is that? What? <laughs> how many armor sets is that? And there's, to this day, there's still so many, I'm like, oh, I forgot that existed. Has terrible range. I think that's every Crimson Heart here, actually. Wow. Crimson, why do you suck so bad? Corruption would never do this to me. <laughs> what is this? What do you think you're doing here? Who do you think you're playing at? Alright, we, we can go to the other one. Let's see what we can make with this stuff. Uh, Brand Confusion, Crimson Torch. I'll just do other thing later. Oh, wow, that's a cool little laser thing it has. Unfortunately, it's broken, so I'm gonna shove it in here and forget it about it. Um... I know people say too much Hollow Knight. I heard you say Terra Grim. <laughs> and in my brain was like, Grim? I play too many single player mods, mods adds more weapons, yeah. Remember first seeing action from uh Player Rhyme's two true melee run, and they used it all the way up until hard mode. Oh cool. Oh well. Yeah, hard mode. It was like I expected hard mode is when it kinda falls off. This is kinda neat. I don't know if I need it. I'll stick it in here. Um blessing for that. Let's put up some paintings. Hey slime. Here, have a painting. My favorite thing about the town slimes is how they uh, make it so that you uh, can actually have the town themes playing basically anywhere. I like that. Sorry to that person who wanted me to get the uh, mini shark. Your time is not now. Oh, right. Or okay. Let's get to this. Oh my God, look at these bars. Don't you lecture me with your $30 haircut? Who? Is that her? <laughs> I don't know. Corruption is so nice in our mode since it has easily accessible demon altars. That's... The, the crimson altars aren't horrible to reach, though, or anything. But I guess there are a bunch of new enemies. Oh, we got a cat straight away. I can't make pickaxe, right? Yes! Okay, I think that will be my first priority, actually. Before I make the armor. Because I just made armor. I don't need more armor straight away. The meatball. Flesh grinder. That's a hammer. I think I could stick with my gold hammer for right now. Hey, he's nice. Leave him alone. Tendon bow. I'm not that into bows right now. So let's make some of the armor. Ah, just short. Alright, we gotta go fight the boss again. That's fine. Do -do 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 Brain of Confusion is really good from what I've heard uh, some people say in times long past. Cat is more important than Mini Shark? Yes, I agree with completely. Sell your old gear? You right. I should honestly do that more. <laughs> I don't know why I don't. Cause like I don't I don't ever play it on wearing this as a set, so as even as vanity, so here, demolitionist, take it. Take this too. Alright, now let's go. <laughs> oh, the cat's in the jungle. Yeah, you could stay there. Oh honestly, I think I'd rather have the cat back in the main village. Whatever. Once the bunny cat dog licenses were unobtainable once you used them once, thank god they changed that. In since journey mode... Oh, they were? They were no longer sold? I may have played after that was patched out. <laughs> when I first started. I first started back in like, uh... Before one... Just before 1.4.1 came out is when I started actually playing this game. For real. Technically, the first time I ever played it was back in 1.3. And back then I wasn't that huge a fan of it from first impressions. But that, I'm so glad I returned because, oh my god, it's so good. Once you really dive deep into it. Goblin Scout? Hey, buddy! 
Good job. You did your uh, society proud. I didn't know we were close enough to the edge to count as Goblin Scout spawning. I guess, yeah, I guess that we are in the outer edges of the world. Alright, here's other Crimson. I have to set up another arena, but that's okay because, um, you know, they're not that hard to make. Ah, yes, I can mine this now! Hooray! Corruption is the best because worm. True, yeah, Eater Worlds is fun. Brenna Cthulhu is pretty fun, too. Oh, damn it, I'm gonna ruin another freaking Lantern Knight. <laughs> first, I ruined the first one. And then I... I had the... I had the True Lantern Knight off camera. So you all didn't get to experience it. And now I'm about to ruin this one, too. I kind of wish Lantern Knights would stick around if you fought another boss, because... Yeah, I don't know. I don't like the fact that they're just... As soon as you summon in a boss, oh, it's cancelled! Because the world is no longer peaceful. Even though it's never been peaceful, there's enemies everywhere. Who doesn't like dumping glitter water on the entire world? Um... I don't know. People who like to be tidy. One of these days, I should uh, think about going into the dungeon. Getting ready for Skeletron. All that. Skeletron is like a boss that has such a huge buff between Classic and Expert. Like on Classic mode, he's absolutely nothing. Terrible, easy boss. You can kill him with freaking... Well, you could probably kill him with like a silver bow. But an Expert, he's like genuinely freaking hard. One of the hardest in free hard mode, if I'd have to get to say. Then again, though, like, I haven't fought Deerclops an expert very much. Alright. Here's a good enough arena. What class are you thinking of being? Any. I usually don't care that much about classes, I just switch as I go. Of course, I, I put on armor appropriate to the types of weapons I'm using, but, like, I just switch it around as I go. If I'm thinking, hey, I want to try some magic weapons for this next thing, then I'll put on magic armor. I'm not going to stick with one class the whole time. Because I did that once, and I found it to be not that fun. Because it just limits what I can use. It, it made this game like Dark Souls. Half the things you pick up can't be used. Magic mirror! Eee! Oh god. Oh wait. Oh my god. I got mo- <laughs> I just noticed I got monster meat. That's a, one of the don't starve items. Right along with the tentacle spike. I have like a little pig pre pet now. Can you- Oh my- How hardy are you? <laughs> little jellyfish out of the water. And it's just still hanging on, taking hit after hit. Peaceful is relative. I mean, the towns are peaceful. Nowhere else is. As soon as you step out of the towns, you're- <laughs> You're in danger. Uh oh, wait. Ah, screw the lantern knights, who cares? <laughs> we'll have a chance in the future to, uh, have one. Alright. Let's get up and at him! Up and at him, boys! Nade. I need to heal right away. I'm gonna take this phase slowly then, so I can let that cooldown run out. Because I, I have a feeling this is gonna go badly for some reason. <laughs> if I, if I... Like, as soon as I enter phase two, I still on potion cooldown. Now, of course, I'm no longer caring about... Excuse me, why are you still spawning in? Why are you still spawning in? Why are you still spawning in? You're not allowed here, this is not your turf. Get out. Oh, s seriously? What? What is going on? Why are there so many? <laughs> Alright, now it's phase two time. Stop spawning spiders! <laughs> what is this game doing? <laughs> this game trying to do to me? 
Other than kill me. Alright. Ah, oh, meteorite! Yeah, that's right. That's what I was doing this for. Meteorite. Um, okay. Okay. <laughs> I'm just kind of swinging it, and I don't know... I, I guess I'm hitting it. Can you please stop spawning spiders, game? <laughs> what is actually wrong with you? There we go. I'll let the damage numbers tell me which one's right. Okay. <laughs> it's getting really hard to find out. Did it. Did it. Did it. Did it. Did it. Alright. We did it. Not too bad. Okay, where did I put the recall potions? I need those down here. Uh, yeah. I got a trophy. Nice. Alright. Rest in peace, we've all been there. Brain's getting melted. The numbers, Duke! The numbers! Terraria, also try to starve. Crimson's scary when there's too many enemies. Four hours at Denny's. <laughs> I just got bouldered. Agony. Oh no. Professional spider stabber. Yep, that's what they call me. At this point, with how many of the fuckers I've had to deal with. All right. No good place to put these up around here. I would need to put them up in the biome, which I guess I could do at some point. I don't know. <laughs> I think I'd rather just not. See, new pet. Aha, very cute. All right, put that away. Now let's make the thing that we need to make. She had another brain of confusion. Is it a better brain of confusion? Arcane. Warding, no, it's not. Out. Oh, wait, no, 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 no. I've learned my lesson. We do not trash things. We sell them. There we go. Can I have, get the mini shark yet? Oh, I actually can. All right, I might go do that. Where's the... Dude, the anvil's right there. Do I not have the bars in my... I don't have the bars in my inventory. That's where I, that was where I was going wrong. I don't have the bars in my inventory. <laughs> Now I'm watching Terraria with music that makes you feel like a literal god. Just put Battlecats or Fortuna in the background. Need to get you to play more, don't starve. True, yeah. I just... I don't know, I haven't been... I haven't been that into it. <laughs> I'm gonna put a... Oh, never mind. Down here. Alright. Now, this. Let's test this out. How's this? Greatly increased life regen. Well, without the banner regeneration, that might be good. Okay. Um, but do I want that over this? How much defense? 30. I'm getting 30 with that, 28 with this. That's a surprising amount of defense, but I guess that's some of my accessories doing that. Um, I'm go grab that. Nothing makes me happier than Terraria playthroughs. Insert clapping. Yay. Um... I, I don't know why, what I'm doing, what I'm saying, just saying, um, 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 um. Yeah, I don't know which one I would rather have. I guess since I'm not using that many magic things right now, we'll go with Crimson. And then I'll, I could swap, here, we can do this. There we go. Look at this. Look at me using the game systems. There we go. I don't ever use loadouts, so maybe I should start. <laughs> Can I combine these yet? Hold on, guide, help. I need a compass before I can combine those, and for this I need tally counter, which I can't get until dungeon. Great. So they're just gonna be sitting in my inventory, taking up space. Until then, that's okay. Um, where do I want to go? Coffee. Where did I want to go? Good question. Uh, I don't know. Here. Oh, wow, it was actually 27 gold the whole time. Cool. Oh, yeah, I wanted to go get the meteorite. Meteorite gotta go do some stuff, hope the stream goes great. Well, thank you for coming in, Ice Rod moment. Ooh, the Ice Rod's gonna be fun, I'm looking forward to that. So, yeah, we're gonna go look for the meteorite. It has landed somewhere on the surface, and I like to collect all that ore. All that good, good ore. Tree armor. When dirt armor? Uh, that's coming 1.4.5. I only get to enjoy it for so long. Oh, 
I brought a drink to stream and I have not... I barely drunk any of it at all. That's the power of streaming. I get so into the game and so into talking that I forget to drink stuff. <laughs> oh, I like the effects on this pickaxe. Do they add these to the uh, nightmare pickaxe? Corruption equivalent? I can't remember. I'm so used to how the game was before 4.4. I did like a couple playthroughs on 4.4. That's it. Because I was busy playing other games at the time, like Hollow Knight. <laughs> Oh, Alright, bye, Jungle Bat. I'll see you later. <laughs> Hydrate yourself. Oops. Just copy with Control C? Oh, uh, yeah. Sure. I'll do that. <laughs> the, the bat actually came all the way back! <laughs> Discovery that helped me along is the fact that Hallow Desert can house both arms dealer and nurse. Well, yeah. Because it's still counted as desert. Um, and the nurse likes the hallow, too. And so they both like it, and so they sell you pounds. But I think it's the whole thing, like, if you pair arms dealer and nurse together, they like wherever they are. Oh my god, I totally haven't realized just how high in the sky I can go. 4.4? That's what I say to mean 1.4.4. I don't feel like saying the 1 every single time, so I say 4.4 instead. I'll also say stuff like 4.1. Wait, what? What was that? What just happened? Oh, that's my armor. Not used to people calling it that. But that's because I'm I'm pretty sure I'm the only person who does. <laughs> I want these shells, because I think I'm gonna use these for um houses. A beach house on the other side of the world, not here. This is not where the meteorite is, good to know. I'm gonna collect some of these shell piles though while I'm here. Okay, YouTube censors YouTube links. Oh yeah, I, I probably have links turned off just because, um, for my comment section and for chat, because I, um, I don't want that. It's gonna stay with music I'm hearing, but okay. Well, it's because when I had links on, I got spam bots in my comment section. And then I think someone, in my first playthrough of this game, actually, Music for the beach in your mind makes me think of Papa's Freezeria. <laughs> well, it's from Super Mario Galaxy 2, so I'm not really sure <laughs> uh, <laughs> how. I guess because it's summer themed and the Freezeria is the ice cream game, so yeah. Yeah, it's like someone in my first story I played that recommended turning off links for comments, and I was like, that's a good idea, I'll do that. And, then, and so that's, we're here now. Ooh, Romeo! Romeo! Where are you, Romeo? Fun fact, I don't think wherefore in wherefore art thou Romeo actually means where. It means, uh... Um, it actually... means why. I, I just, I learned that from some random video somewhere. Some random Spyro playthrough somewhere. That's not material. This is. I thought you could build stuff with shells. You can make reef blocks with coral. I thought you could build stuff with shells, that's why I was getting them. <laughs> YouTube links are off, you can't rickroll like that? Oh no! <laughs> You're right, I'll turn them on right now. No, I won't. I'm sorry. I didn't go all the way to the other side of the world, I guess because I got everything. I've seen enough. <laughs> Thomas had seen enough. It was time for <laughs> it was time for Thomas to leave. Ooh, um, never mind. I don't need to do that right now. Oh, Rainbow's hat hood. Isn't this set, like, dedicated to the creator's kid? Water gun. No thanks. Do not eat the vile mushroom. Well, these houses need some decoration, so I'm gonna put that up. Oh, wow. <laughs> cool. They also added so many paintings in the update, too. How much gold do I have? One, one, one. I'll get it. It's a vanity set, right? Yes, it is. It looks neat, actually. Let's look with this. Uh, I think I think it's better with the hood. Yeah, let's uh, let's put this on for a while. <laughs> no, get this thing, viruslink.exe. <laughs> yeah, sand is indeed the most OP item in the game. One shots moon squid. Yeah, because everyone was wondering how to kill the moon squid effectively. All right. 
We've killed Brain of Cthulhu. We have our armor. We have our heading. Here we go! So I think let's go Splunking. Let's go down here a little bit. We also have the mini shark and we can use it underground. So like my plan for this was it was gonna go down here and then find our way into the center area. Because I, I still wanna find glowing mushroom biome. I still wanna find all that stuff. I like that your character's hair sticks out of the hood. It's cute. Yeah, I like that too. How's the uh thing look like? I don't like the helmets in this game, most of them. Some of the vanity hats look good, and those are the ones I've been wearing, but like as soon as I get familiar wig, I'm probably never gonna take that thing off, because I do not like the helmets for the armors in this game. And that also kind of carries over to Dark. Ah! I totally forgot I was looking for this. It's right here. Alright, cool. Let's mine this. Ow. I'm burning. And here's the meteorite, so this is gonna give us lots of good chow. Oh my god. Alright, that's pretty decent. I wish I could blow this up, but that'll have to wait until hard mode. When, you know, when I won't need this anymore. The Eye of Cthulhu's free gold? Probably, yeah. And maybe even at this point in my playthrough, because, like, this is expert mode Eye of Cthulhu, who isn't necessarily a free victory like he's in Classic, but... Um... I'm sure that would be the case. I remember trying to farm up stuff for the Clintaminator, um, and just, like, I, I killed King Slime over and over again. It was super, super slow. I don't know how I thought it was going to get money in hard mode by killing a pre-hard mode boss over and over again, but that was my thought process, so. <laughs> what I really should have done was summon a Solar Eclipse. Those things, you make bank from those freaking things. Familiar Wing is fire, so nice. Familiar Wig, yeah. Wow, it landed so close to these guys' house! You know what, I'm gonna leave the crater here. Now's a better time than any to connect, uh, to connect this little tunnel here that I've wanted to connect. Right. Pick up you... Um, I... hate the burning effect. Good thing Brain of, Brain of, Brain of Confusion came in and saved me. Nope. 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 Out of here. Thank you. These guys are the weirdest drop ever, where they have a chance of dropping one piece of meteorite ore. However, here's the weird part. Only in pre-hard mode. <laughs> as soon as you enter hard mode, they can't drop anything anymore. And I do not get that at all. <laughs> what is what is the deal with that? My health's getting a little low. Because I'm being careless. Ow. Yeah, I'm being a little careless. Uh, take all the paper, take all the toilet paper. I don't know what that has to do with anything. Um, but I will take the meteorites. I'd also like to not make this a meteorite biome anymore, so I'm going to have to break lots of this. We're going to be here for a while, guys. Just strap in. End up doing multi-shot mods to make it more fun. You mentioned you obsess over the snowball cannon too much. Oh, like multi-shot mods and you can shoot it too much. Yeah. I haven't used it that much, mostly because, like, after a while it gets super outclassed by stuff like the boomstick or, um, the mini shark. But it's pretty good for, like, you know, dive into a cave, grab your first treasure. It's good. I quite enjoy it. Simple, my man. It doesn't have anything to do. All right. Well, yeah, you're right about that. Might be easier just to enable smart cursor. I mean, for stuff like that, but, like, I can't go that far. There was a traveling merchant earlier this stream who sold an extendo grip. I could use that right now. <laughs> oh, man. I could also dig up from below, I guess. Just, this is, this is always kind of annoying when you don't have good stuff. Hold on a moment. I just remember something. Hold on. I have an obsidian skull. What am I doing? I have an obsidian skull. I could have just used this the whole time. So Volcano is also fun for hitting your friends with in multiplayer. I don't remember us doing that, but I guess that happened. 
I hope the obsidian skull works for meteorite too, and it's not just hellstone. Flying rocks? You just noticed those? <laughs> but yes, there there are flying meteor heads coming at me. Oh my god! Oh my god! I can't believe I didn't figure this out sooner. Well, looks like we won't be here for a while. That's right, I collected some obsidian earlier. Because there was lava. Um, nuclear warheads? Where? Who alerted nuclear warheads? Are you trying to get me arrested? Oh. <laughs> I guess we had turned on PvP for a while there, and I had accidentally killed you with it. Or maybe on purpose, I don't know. Omosito gets hunched by Doggo. Yep, there's a dog here, for sure. It's okay, I could just stay still and then pet him, and then he'll be so confused that I'll be able to spare him. Excuse me, leave Tiggard alone over there. What's that name? T T Tiggard? I don't know how to pronounce that. <laughs> oh, I need this. Give me that. I had to turn down the volume on this one a lot so it doesn't get too ear grating. This guy playing makes the meteors feel like they're the last boss after Cthulhu. I hope progression in these streams will speed up after, um... Speed up after a while. Because right now it's been kind of slow, you know. I've been going, taking baby steps, killing one boss at a time. I think you need Shroomite to make nukes. Um... Yeah. You know, the Shroomite nuke, the famous Terraria item. <laughs> I sure do love myself a Shroomite nuke. Just gonna make this man upgrade his house so they don't look like shoeboxes anymore. I thought, I thought people said they were good! I mean, like, how... I like building boxy rooms. I might add some, like, extra decoration to set them apart from each other, so that they aren't just wooden boxes, but otherwise, <laughs> they work. I'm just, I'm not good at building, like, fancy shapes in this game. The blocks are so small, it takes me forever, if you want me to do that on stream, you're gonna be watching me do that for two hours. That's why I built houses off camera in between streams. Alright, can can this meteorite go away soon? I've broken like almost every block. Can we, can we not do this anymore? There we go. It's done. Right. <laughs> I like your houses? Thank you, someone agrees. Music is godlike and you know this kind of music is meter slowly flies towards you. Pure inferno. Yeah, unfortunately, if I played that on stream, it would probably be copyright. He sends me to this world, I'll upgrade his house. <laughs> what am I taking damage from? I was on fire for a second, I guess I got hit by an enemy. There we go, I wanted to take his tunnel. Anyway, now to do what I was going to do. I'll go put the meteorite away. Now to go do what I was gonna do a while ago. Let's see, what can we make with this right now? We can make the space gun. Could also make the meteor set for ooh, 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 ooh. Um, what color? Let's go with blue. I think I'll replace the Star Fury with that. The, the phase blades are super fun. Yeah. <laughs> Meant to the meteor was 500 times bigger. Oh God, terrible. Don't don't suggest that. Um, space gun. Oh yeah, this. Let's make this can sell those. Uh, I'll, I'll leave the space gun for uh, later. I think I'll mess with these right now, but I'll leave it in my inventory. Then the meteor set. Do I have enough for it all? I do! Hey! I'll also uh, save this for later. Or I'll put it in loadout three. There we go. Alright, now to move on to what I was going to do. I'm going to be saying that so many times as we keep going throughout this game, because that's just how this game is. There's so many things you can do in it. And I'm just gonna... I'm gonna have to do it one at a time, and I'm gonna decide the order. Legit Minecraft post-creeper encounter moment. What was? Now the hole is ugly? 
Yeah. Yeah, a little, a little bit. That's what you mean by it, okay. <laughs> it is a little bit, but hey. I didn't ask for the meteor to land there. If I connect- if I collect enough snow blocks from the place, I could always fill it back up. I could patch it with a completely unfitting block just for the meme. <laughs> like, I could take some snow from a hill and put it there. I have to look- I got quite a few snow blocks, so we could do that. But, exploration first. Building stuff later. Star Wars, The Man Awakens. Yes. What's worse, rolling cactus, bouncy boulder, or heart boulder? Well, I haven't messed with those boulders, so I would say rolling cactus. <laughs> Even though they're, you know, they're not terrible. Yeah, I just didn't pick this one up. This is the wrong... That's fine, we can find our way over. I don't know if, um, if it has since the is not from Ponus, but it has credits. And Ponus basically stole that song from another stop song. Alright. Hello. I should... Hold on. Nah. We're, we're going to the other cave entrance. The other cave entrance has what, what, what I actually want. Snow pants. Uh, sure, I guess. <laughs> I know, how dare people have conversations in, in my chat. How dare they talk back and forth? How dare they discuss... ...speak words... ...on a screen? I don't mean to be too mean with that. I like how the brain of confusion protected me against the sand. <laughs> that was pretty funny. Hello, pot. Ooh, ice torch. Nice. I'm not gonna use those yet, because I don't care as much as Redigit does. No chatting in chat, guys, it's illegal. You, yep, you heard her. No chatting. Hey, you, you gotta get the fuck out of here. Alright, we're back in a regular cave, which means that we will not be chilled by entering water. Ooh! Oh! Um, yeah, that was a trap. <laughs> Take that. Crimtain down there. I'd rather just kill a boss to get that. I don't know if I need ores anymore. I'm mainly looking for a glowing mushroom mount because I like that. Read. Wait, poor Omencito. Read, then comment. Hollow purple. Some guy found out Nebula Gauntlet exists, probably. Mayo? Mayo, mayo? Mayonnaise? I have mayonnaise now? Anyways. Okay. That's Boy Group. I don't need that. Alright. Well, this is a load of usefulness <laughs> that I'm seeing here. That's a nice skin potion you have, isn't it? I ah, just. Never mind, that was rope. Alright, you're useless. Moving on. Mayo, 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 mayo. Okay, why are you spamming mayo now? What's the reason for spamming mayo? Maybe we're to finish reading. Oh, wait. <laughs> wait for me to read. You don't have to do that. Just keep chatting. If I... I, I can always look back at older messages. I have, I've got a lot of messages on screen. Yummy mayo. I can tell you like mayonnaise. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> The day after, I think. No, wait, two days after. Alright, well, we're not going to get that one. Oh, this is a gem cave. This is a ruby cave. That's why I saw glowy. No, wait, it's it's not a ruby cave. It's not a ruby cave at all. Oh. Well, um, let's blow it up then. It's, it's worthless, because it's not a ruby cave. Ooh, life crystal! I'm so glad I bombed, actually! All right, just one more of those, and we can have all 400 health. Mayo, 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 mayo. <laughs> 2,763,000 boss health bar appears. Oh, no. Oh, 
is a, a final boss of this game has something close there, to there. I don't think it goes above a million, but it's certainly a hundred thousand something. Over a hundred thousand. Actually, it might be a million. I, I don't even know. <laughs> Alright, well, we actually gonna find anything other than these tiny rooms with nothing in them? Or are we going to keep finding tiny rooms with nothing in them? Uh, seems like that's... Seems like we're just going to keep finding tiny rooms with nothing in them. Exciting. Should I go look for a pyramid? So I can obtain the sandstorm in a bottle? There's our last life crystal. Bam! 400 health. At last. Stream 3. Profile lightning. My weakness! <laughs> Calamity bosses get there. I, I, for sure, probably. No! Falling Stars of Doom! Holy shit. These guys are duking it out. Give me your clothes. You gave me bombs. No, that's not great. That's great. I wanted your clothes, and you didn't listen. Alright. There's a salamander. Who drops compasses again? I think it's piranhas in the jungle, actually. So if I wanted a compass, I should go over there. Oh my god. Okay. Shut... Should I just give up on this? <laughs> we could probably find a glowing mushroom biome somewhere else. There's just so many dead ends here. This is getting annoying. So I think I'm gonna actually go... Let's go to the desert. Let's look for a, um... A thingy. A pyramid. See if we have one in this world. Because we might not. Why is that door still open? Necromance power revives Cthulhu. Rip Polar Void. They just loved Mayo too much. Yeah. <laughs> Turns into Cthulhu. Hello, mate! <laughs> At a refresh my page since the website decided to hide chat. Interesting. You will not see chat. I'm gonna collect some of these, because I think... Well, there's an armor you can make from this, but I think it might be like a ranged armor set, isn't it? Plot twist! I'm gonna go this way, search for a pyramid. Because I feel like... Maybe there could be one here? Let me dig it down from the surface. If there's not one over here, then there just isn't one, and we'll have to... If we want the bundle of balloons, we'll have to go to another world. Explodes or f okay tsunami of blood. What are y'all doing? Just find the nearest orphanage and explode it. I never expected such chaos to occur in my streams, but uh, seems like seems like that's exactly what I'm getting. Hey, a pyramid! <laughs> yes, I'm glad I did that. All right, here we go. We can make bundle of balloons now. We'll need to find the shimmer first, but now we have a flying carpet! Cool! Now we can go down from the pyramid into the place. That's also a lot of gold. Oh my god, that, that really is a lot of gold. Holy shit. Okay, well, better not die down here. Well, okay, okay, that's enough gold game. You can stop giving me the gold. Where's this block? Sandstone brick, okay. This should take us down into the dungeon itself. Yay. You gotta admit, I'm an OP boss. I just necromanced Cthulhu. Yeah, that is, uh, that's pretty OP. He's here for three seconds, uh, after wearing a full star armor with this treasure I summon! <laughs> Rawr, me scary. Yeah, you definitely- uh, good, good job, Cthulhu. <laughs> have I already been here? No, I haven't. Yes, I have? No, I haven't. That's an extractinator. I- I would remember that. Alright. Y'all ready? For desert caves? Cause I'm not, this is gonna suck. Alright. I don't know why, I, I found what I'm, what I was looking for out down here, so I don't know why I'm going down here more, but I found this house, and so I wanna, I wanna see. And you never know, we could find more stuff, like there's the encumbrance stone, I've always wanted to find one of those. Dune Rider boots, I don't need these anymore. But, uh, cool, thanks game. I'll take the potions. I guess I'll take these for, uh, Vanity. Vanity, as that one, uh, character in Paper Mario is known as. 
Ooh, scarab bombs. I want those. Ear piercing screech. <laughs> Casually spawns 19 moon lords. Um, no? <laughs> it's okay, though. I'll just die to them, and then all of them will despawn simultaneously. It'll be okay. I don't need two of these. Oh, hey, hey, wait a minute. All right. Break pot. Also, destroy cactus. Cactus must be destroyed. Can I destroy cactus through wall? Yes, I can. Perfect. Whoa, whoa, hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. I just ran into those guys without seeing them. Quit eyeballing me. <laughs> I don't know what's going on anymore. <laughs> Make it 38. Okay. Casually watches the boss battle in the distance. Wow, nature is amazing. <laughs> nature is so cool. It can spawn 19 moon lords. I need this for heart lanterns. Builder potions. Fuck off. I don't care. Okay. Ooh, another house! I never find houses in this place this much. So this is very exciting to me. Take the miner clothes. Oh, he got incinerated. Well, the miner clothes might still be there. Hold on. Oh god. <laughs> Magic conch! Ooh, this is good! I'm so glad I stayed here! Because I was for a second wondering, like, wh what am I still doing here? Oh no, I'm so happy I st have stayed, actually. That's good. That teleports me to the oceans. Now... Yeah, I'd rather take that. I think that might be it for this place for now, though. We can always save the golfer. Oh, the golfer's near. Where is he? Oh god, you're liking mayo again. You're going on a mayo frenzy again. Where is Golfer? In a place I've already been to. Apparently he's near. Dies from consuming too much mayo. Alright. There's this broken life crystal? Who broke the life crystal? What? Why is the life crystal broken? Uh, I'll take it, but why is it broken? Is it all for down here? If only I had a hunter potion or whatever else. Are, yeah, enemies are shown on, or NPCs are shown on hunter potions. Put the stars in ammo slot, by the way, just to save one more inventory slot. I suppose I can. Nice. Because those are ammo for... Uh, hey, oh, I see him. I see him. Oh, God, he's dying. He's dying, he's dying, he's dying, he's dying. No, 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 no. No, he died! Because <laughs> something spawned in the room with him! Oh, love this game. Oh, the the tavern keep is also near. Ant lions are ants that are lions. Still disgusting. Uh, I don't know if they're actually... They're, there is a real insect called ant lions, and they don't look anything like lions, and that's what these guys are based off of, I'm pretty sure, so... But, I mean, they are acting very lion-like, I will agree with that. Black, re black recluses are disgusting. Disgusting! Ow. That hit me. In the face. The Russians bombarded my ho home in 1903. Uh, that's a very- that's a very interesting topic change there. <laughs> you talk about black recluses one moment, and then the next. <laughs> the, <laughs> the Russians bombed my home. Or, were the Russians black recluses? Alright, um, I don't see a golfer on the thing. I think I'm just gonna go. That was a fun little excursion, though. Her bag, let's put those away. Let's put these in. Oh. Uh, oof. Does it only take one life crystal to make those? Yes. So let's make some then. Bone Javelin? That looks... Hmm... Sturdy fossils is what you make those out of. I guess I'll try those. 
Um, how about... Heart Lantern, there we go. I want to make a couple of these. Something to use my things on. I was the Russian. I like being random. Lamo. I forgot I took this off. Same, you are Russian? Nope, but I can do Russian dance easily. Alright. Interesting facts. Okay. Uh, put this painting up somewhere, like here. Or maybe in one of the- actually, put it in one of the desert houses. Alright. Where the hell do I store scarab bombs? God, I'm running out of storage space <laughs> faster than I expected. Alright. Sandstone blocks, you go in here. God damn, this chest is full. Alright. Well, um, fun. Place the statue on top of the leaves. There's a traveling merchant now. Chandelier that goes here. Um, I guess I could keep these on me. Maybe instead of throwing knives, because I'm not going to need those anymore. Yep. Now, this I'm gonna keep on me because, uh, we should go looking for Shimmer. Maybe I could... I was thinking of either ending stream by building something in space, or maybe I could go look for the, um... Ooh, code one. Five gold? Yeah, let's get it. Cargo summon. I don't know. I think I'll wait. Chef set might be fun, though. Yeah, let's get that. Thanks, bud. But, uh, if nothing else, we could always go look for the Shimmer. Do all that. Willie the Merchant! Actually, it is also getting kind of late where I am. Stacking regen, I just need honey, regen ring, and celestial werewolf and folk stuff. I, I don't know if I'm gonna need all of that uh, to beat the bosses, but sure. I'll be on the lookout for all of those things. Did I take the hat? I guess I didn't, because I don't like hats usually, so, yeah, makes sense. What do I have on me right now? Oh, I have, like, three different accessories. Right. Oh, shoot. To get another balloon, I'm going to need to... I love these streams. Well, thank you. I'm going to need to, um... What? I bought this? When did I buy this? Alright, I'll get drunk then. Sure, why not? Um, I'm going to need to, uh, fish, probably. Get a crate. Oh, there's so many things I need to do. <laughs> I stopped being playing Bee Swarm Simulator for this little worth it, though. Monkey. Okay. Holy moly, moly. Can't just understand anything. I have three overlapped windows. <laughs> Dude, no one can understand anything anymore. This stream has been the most surreal experience I've, I've ever had. Yeah, let's pay attention to the map where I am. Bone Javelins remind me of my boy Thrower class. Right, didn't they remove that? I remember that, too. There are like there was a special type of damage for throwing. It is all but a myth in Thorium. It will never be the same. Five overlapped screens. Did you increase the number? Bro, I'm cracked at Beast Orb Simulator. I got five mythics at mid game. I don't know what this is about, but it's cool. This stream at the start was basically Bee Swarm Simulator, right? We went to the place full of bees in this game. Tingly sitting on a chair also helps with regen, because that's a regen mechanic works, so yeah. But, I mean, are you going to be able to sit on a chair in the middle of a bus? <laughs> the music is pure gibberish at this point. Your music or mine? This isn't gibberish. Another lake. Really wants me to fish up here, doesn't it? 93,542 overlapped windows at the moment. How good is your computer? <laughs> that, that harpy spawned on screen. I know your tricks. Internet purely died. Well, I would imagine if you have that many windows open, all taking up space. Okay. I need to decide on something to do to end. 
and I think I might want to look for Shimmer, um, because that will be useful, so I can get closer to crafting that bundle of balloons. Uh, there was nothing here. Cool. Although, of course, to craft the bundle of balloons, we're going to need to frickin', uh, we're get, yeah, we're gonna need a fish for more balloons, but I guess I could go fish a little bit, get started on that, I'll see why not. Why am I tired looking? Oh, because I'm tipsy, right? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. There's so many things I want to do, and I just cannot decide how to do them. Why did I take this off? Oh, because I want a royal gel on instead. Well, we don't need a uh, obsidian skull, so... Yeah, there we go. Make undersea base? Yeah, that is also a good idea. I just don't know if I want to keep going with houses yet right now. I'd rather end by doing something more exciting. Like, um, venturing down here, where the shimmer would be. To make an air block by placing two trapdoors closed. Airlock by placing two trapdoors. I don't know if that would work. The, the, the water, I think, flows in with the trapdoors. So, it's not like Minecraft where the water will just stay put. Water will actually flow inside, so that wouldn't be great. Unless I use, like, a pump or something. Which we would need the mechanic for. Which also means that we should go near the dungeon. God. <laughs> Alright. I, I cannot decide what order to do things in. I think for ending... Let's, let's make the shimmer known. I'll bring along this, I'll bring along, oh, uh, hopefully we'll find a life crystal on the way to it, because I'm going to need that for it. Use the code one a little bit. Then we'll find the shimmer, we'll say, hey, cool, it's the shimmer. And then I guess I can, like, I could maybe get started on building a space station, but if I wanted to build a space station, I need, like, sci-fi looking blocks, and skyware blocks just aren't that. I want to be a blue hive. Alright then, be a blue hive. You can be whatever you want, right? People told me that in school. We search for the shimmer, yeah. That's what I'm doing. Hello? You okay? Why were you talking? What? Why was that piranha talk- Oh. What? Who's talking? Someone was playing rock, paper, scissors over here. That must be a bug. It, it must be that- Emote was horribly displaced over the piranha. Why was a piranha playing rock, paper, scissors? Two doors to the environment is always separate from inside. But no, like the water will flow out inside of it because of the how the water works. I I think without using pumps. So we probably have to. If we were to make that, we'd have to do that later. Oh, hello, other meteorite. I'm gonna I'm gonna skip out on this one. This one can stay. Water physics are just bring water in, you need a pump or have an open air entrance, yeah. Which we could do, we can have an open air entrance. Then make door of blocks? What, use blocks as the door? That sounds horribly inconvenient. <laughs> Alright, I think I'm gonna use underground crimson. Or this little hole right here to get ourselves down in there. Maybe the piranha was bored, you don't know I'm true. Casually floats away. Alright, bye. Your people need you, I guess. <laughs> Use a shimmer to make sandstorm ball. That's exactly what I plan to do, my friend. I got this right here. This is actually the first time I've crafted the bundle of balloons. Because, like, it's not terribly necessary, but it is nice to have. Because it lets you jump, like, four times. No! Not Willy. Well, Willy has other places to be. Or Wily. I don't know. How do you pronounce that name? <laughs> Saying Willy doesn't sound right, but I'm sure that's what it is. It's, like, short for William. To the Netherlands. <laughs> Microwaves the man. Okay, good luck with that. Speed this up. Should be somewhere over here, the thing is, the shimmer. And then when we find it, that's where I'm gonna end. And we could do some building next time. We could do build the ocean house, we could build the space station. Um actually I don't know if we can because I don't know if we have any fitting blocks at the moment. I 
can build something up at space, and then we can convert it over later. And we could do some- start fishing, because I'm gonna need to fish for the balloons anyway, so... May as well get those quests done as well. Well, we don't- uh, Wily would only have one L, yeah. <laughs> yeah, like Dr. Wily and Mega Man. Welcome to the Nethermans. <laughs> the, the Nethermans? The Nethermans! Do Dr. Bones? Oh my god. Where's the- where's the Dr. Bones? Emer emergency alert, we have a Dr. Bones. Where's Dr. Bones? This is a super rare enemy. But I wanna- I wanna find him. Where is he? Uh, I have the Scarab Bobs on me, right? Go, Scarab Bombs. Take me further in. That didn't help. Scarab Bombs, you suck. How dare you, Scarab Bombs. Where is this Dr. Bones? Sand, get out of the way! I want to find him before he disappears. The sand was killing me. Speak Dutch to me, Leather Lens Boy. Dutch! <laughs> yeah, that's exactly... <laughs> that's the Dutch language. They just say Dutch over and over again. Here he is! Give me that hat, sir. You have a thousand health. That's okay. I got a thousand patience. I spoke Dutch, damn got me there. <laughs> archaeologist hat. Unfortunately, I can't get the rest of the Archaeologist set, which is actually one of my favorite vanity sets. It looks really nice, because that needs a Corruption World. It's made out of rotten chunks, and you can't get those in Crimson Worlds without growing your own Corruption biome, which, that's whatever. Alright. How'd y'all feel if I say, like, all of the building will happen off-stream, because I feel like it's better for there, or I can do it at the end of the stream if I feel like doing it on-stream. But, like, you know, if I want to build something that you all want me to make, I should do it on-stream so that y'all can give me feedback on how I'm doing, how I'm making the thing to your liking. But if it's just, like, I'm gonna go build an ocean house, I'm gonna d definitely do that in between streams, because, um, I learned my lesson from last stream, which was bloated with nothing but me just freaking building houses for the first half. Ow. Why did that one hurt? Alright, whatever. Alright, I need to exit the jungle on this side. I, I don't even need those materials anymore. I hope you become famous one day, as do I. Uh, I need to... Okay, uh, we're going down, I guess. We're yelling timber. It's on the same side of the world as jungle, but it is not inside the jungle. So if I could, you know, exit the jungle, that would be really nice. You deserve love, this is fun to watch. Well, thank you. I've yet to revisit one of my own streams. Because, like, I don't know if it's the type of thing I'd want to watch again. It's more fun to watch live than it is to watch after the fact streams in general. Why is that hit- it wasn't hitting me before, I thought. Alright, we're gonna blindly kill this one, and yep, it's dead. <laughs> Whoa, Pigman just flew at me. Okay, that one didn't hurt me. Really specific. Please find an open cavern. This is fun to watch. I don't know why. I don't know. Maybe it's because you find things personally entertaining? This doesn't have to be a weird reason or anything. It's like every stream, but you, you actually read the comments on like other people? Really? Because most small streamers I watch read chat. I mean, like, the big streamers that have, like, so many chat messages they can't possibly keep up with them. I mean, like, still, most of the ones I watch still, uh read chat. But, like, I understand if they're so huge that there's, like, a million messages that they just don't even bother. They're just like, yeah, nah. I also feel like it would be weird to watch yourself streaming. Yeah, true. I I'd rather be the streamer, not the viewer. 
Perfect. What's in here? Another method of things. Um, suspicious looking eye, Jester's arrows, and thingy. Alright. Featherfall. Yeah, we can take these. Oh, dead man's chest. I should take this. This could be fun. This could be a fun wiring chest. Chest to store wiring materials. I could, like, have it activate something every time I open. That would be cool. That would be funny. Alright. Uh, you die before you can throw too many of me. What are you, Papyrus? <laughs> Are you focus and read so like so cool when you see Omencito's golden comment. Oh, we found Shimmer. A is right here. Ooh, heart reach potion. I'll take that. All right. Uh, first things first. I'm gonna build platforms over it. I have not found a life crystal nearby, unfortunately. So I'm going a brief search for that. Oh god, here's the one thing that sucks about Shimmer. It makes the enemies invisible for whenever they land in it. That's, it'll be okay, it's just annoying. How much health do you guys have? Uh, whatever it is, that is way too much. 160! Okay, it's not that you have too much health, it's that you're barely taking any damage. Oh god, oh! Ow! Ow! Oh! I forgot Shimmer Reflexor Projectiles! Oh god! Okay. Uh, let's Shimmer this. Before I build over it. Now I can make the balloons. That's Pharaoh's set. That's not what I want. I'll have messages for seconds where you just have to stop reading. Yeah. It's a me, Yoshi, the the green lizard from my I I cannot imagine what Yoshi sounds like when he talks for some reason. That's just never been something I've expected him to do. It's me, Yoshi, from Mario's Green Lizard Gang. Alright, gem trees. Ooh, let's look for a life crystal in here. Hey, we found a life crystal! Okay, stream's over, guys. <laughs> awesome. Um, I'm gonna go back this way. Oh, did you, are you like... Did you fall in the shimmer? Did any of you fall in the shimmer? I love using this as a weapon. It's actually really nice. There we go. Brit British Yoshi. <laughs> With the accent I was using, I was, like, putting on an Italian accent for a while. I don't, I don't know where British came from, but... Alright, that'll increase life regeneration. It'll increase the acceleration at which it happens. And, uh, there's a number of other things we can get out of that, but for right now, I think I'm good with just that. How's this look with this set on? Oh, that actually looks really nice. We can, uh, we can take off the vanity set. I think it's been long enough. We could switch outfits. Did I not... Wait. I thought I... Okay. I thought I... Did I not throw the Pharaoh set back in? Hold on. It's just giving me the flying carpet back. It's not letting me get a sandstorm and a bottle from this. Alright, I'm gonna have to check the wiki in a second. Will you get in there? Yeah, it's just switching between robe and thing. Alright, uh, leaving you all in silence as I uncover this mystery. Shimmer. Sh Shweemer. Yeah, it's... We need the mask. We need Pharaoh's mask to get Sandstorm in a bottle. The flying carpet just becomes the robe. Yep. So, we didn't get... If we got the Pharaoh set on this world, we would have been able to get all items, but now we can't. I thought... I read that on the wiki recently, and I thought it was like you could shimmer between all the items that you actually can't. Yep. Well... It's fine, we didn't need bundle of balloons anyway. <laughs> I'm sorry, but it's true. We didn't need it. Oh my god, look at all this. Oh, there's a house too. Okay, hold on, we're sticking around for a little while. We're putting this back on. I need it. I need the inventory space. I love these caves anyway. I, I, it's so weird to me. We found a glowing moss cave before a glowing mushroom cave? How does that make any sense? 
Oh, an armed zombie statue. Those are kind of uncommon. I don't need that. All right. GG, start a new world. Yeah, if I... Well... <laughs> I don't feel the need to get it, to be honest. I just, um... I think we can go with just two double jumps. Like, having two double jumps is fun enough. Here, speaking of two double jumps, let's put that back on. There we go. Alright. Well, that was that. At least we found the shimmer. I'm probably gonna add some kind of teleporter to it. I guess uh, we should start working towards the dungeon pretty soon. Oh my god. I just found a whole new layer of the place. Look, there's a water chest. Inner tube. Do I have an inner tube? Oh my god, do I have an inner tube? <laughs> there's so many things to get. Here. Sticky bombs. I just put... I just clogged up my inventory with more stuff. Um... In case we don't, I'll pick that up, and that'll get out of here before we continue any further. That's an interesting looking cave. We'll come back to that later. Take that off. That looks ridiculous. Uh, this looks like we do not have an energy. Very cool. Water is a simple molecule composed of two small positively charged hydrogen atoms and one uh, large negatively charged oxygen atom. When the hydrogens bind to the oxygen, it creates an asymmetrical mo molecule with positive charge on one side and negative charge. Cool. Fun facts with profile. I'm gonna put on the Pharaoh's robe for a time. But in either case, that shall be it for this stream session. That was a bunch of good progress. In fact, it was so much good progress. Um, you know, aside from the fact we only killed one boss, ignore that. It was good progress. <laughs> I'm gonna go put this armed zombie statue in the middle of the forest somewhere where no one will find it. I am evil and y'all will conquer the planet. Oh man, I didn't realize reading your chat messages was actually giving you power this whole time. Damn. I just cursed everyone in the world. Whoops. Do I have wiring chest yet? Nope. This is for later. Um, pressure plate, don't need you. That's for the wiring chest that will come later. I'll leave the bone javelins in my inventory then. You guys deserve a chandelier. Take a chandelier. It'll go well with the blocks. Sorry, die trader, you get nothing. All right, well, um, life crystal should go somewhere in the ore's chest. You may have only killed one boss, but you did kill it twice. Sure, yeah, I guess that counts for something. Um, oh, actually, no, we killed two bosses. We got King Slime. So yeah, we got uh, we got two bosses. Did better than I thought. I guess next time I'll. Off stream, I'm going to build a house over here so that we can get started towards the dungeon. Then we can see about building something in space. Um, then I could probably select a location for an underground house. I would think over here, but I don't know. I've, I'd probably want to have it somewhere like here, maybe. So that it doesn't get immediately corrupted. Then again, this could be in the... whatever. Anyway, uh, for now, that is the end. So thank you for everyone for coming. Like seriously, that was really, really cool having 10 people all talking in chat um, at once. Oh, hails yeah. Time for a world conquering breaks through wall. Oh yeah, are you the freaking dude from, <laughs> are you the, are you the Kool-Aid man? Uh, yep. Yeah. So this has been, I, I really don't know how to end streams. I'm not used to this at all. <laughs> so. Thank you all so much for coming. It's been really fun. Thank you, especially those who chatted, which was most people, I think. That was, um, this is, uh, this is a moment to remember. Um, thank you all for watching, if you did. And as always, I will see you all in the future. It's been fun. Don't come back. <laughs> Just makes me think of GLaDOS. <laughs>